Hello, everybody. It's Monday, November 14th. Thank you, everybody, for being here on this beautiful Monday's The H3 Podcast. Back with another action-packed week of shows. Hi. Yes, not with Elon Ma. He, uh, apparently, <laughs> apparently we don't have the funds to get the real Elon Ma. And although, Dude Fresh did get them. Uh, Dude Perfect. Dude Fresh? Dude, I'm so tired, bro. Dude Fresh. Oh, my God. Speaking of Dude Fresh, this episode is sponsored by Honey. We love them so much. Thank you. Um, we have so much fun uh, things planned today. The main segment that we've got here for you guys is the egg drop, inspired by uh, our, our friend of the show, William. And um, you can see that. Yeah, so we are going to compete. We have five teams of two and we are going to see who can assemble the most action packed drop proof egg sack yes sir it's going to be exciting me and Dan are going to win for sure I already know exactly what I'm doing that egg is not breaking yeah it's going to be fun uh God. Oh, I'm so tired, you guys. Yeah. But anyway, yeah, this the, the egg great. drop was inspired by uh, William Osmond, friend of the show. So it looks fun, and we're going to do it, God damn it! Also, Teddy Fresh Black Friday sale is still happening. That's right, teddyfresh.com. It'll, I think it's going through the end of November. And uh, there's still a bunch of good shit up there, although it's moving fast, so... Get up there, take a look. It's teddyfresh.com. Up to 70% off this Black Friday. Thank you, thank you. Wednesday, Howie is coming in, people. Howie Mandel. I'm nervous. What do we do about it? You're nervous? A little bit. I'm excited. Ow. I'm so excited. <laughs> Me and Howie are dogs. We're like, we're cool. I feel like Howie's one of those people I could say anything to. Really? What we've been through. You, you know, know him that well. want to get canceled. Yeah, we're, we are. We're dogs, I feel like, okay. you know. Whatever you guys linked, by the way, is a dead. It doesn't work. In the Howie spot. Wait, was that the one he posted today? Acknowledging the prolapse on TikTok? Yeah. Yeah, it's down. Oh, no. Oh, I just checked it. That's too. I got a... it backed up, Howie. Nice Damn, try. Howie. Nice try, Howie. It was such a funny TikTok. Why is he got to be so embarrassed by it? <laughs> Nothing. I felt like he's he was. He's got to be ready to talk on this prolapse by 48 hours from now, because there's no way. He knows what he's getting stuff yeah. into. He, you know, that's, that's going to be the whole episode, basically. I'm fine, people. <laughs> yeah, so he posted a really funny TikTok of... Uh, here, actually, we got it. Thank you, AB. Today we're going to mm -hmm. talk about one... So wait, how the fuck do I... This is in Discord. How do I expand it? Uh, here, I'll play it on oh, my I computer. Got it, I got it, I got it, I got it. You got it? I think so, yeah. A little tricky, but... This is a tech it. episode. We can Today figure this talk. out. One of the most disturbing and fucked up <laughs> videos to ever hit this app. Yes. I took it down, okay? Okay? <laughs> Why did he rate Tally? Stop. You're doing so good. <laughs> yeah. So we're we're going to have a lot of talk about on uh on Wednesday. So I'm very excited about that. The number one <laughs> podcast in the world. That's what I'm saying. That's we're dogs. Right. Actually, a lot and a lot, a hugely eventful weekend. Uh, my car was stolen and destroyed, <clears throat> as well as my heart. We'll talk about that later. But it's insane. Also, Olivia was attacked by a dog. Not kidding. How are you? I'm okay. I'm I'm on pain stuff, so it feels a little bit better. But I was indeed. I was attacked by a pit bull. Show me your. Uh, where um, you it's bit. it's gnarly. It's there's blood seeping through. But. Oh my god, dude. Yeah, he, he got me pretty bad. Did um, you pull that up to the camera so they can see the bandage? Are they allowed to see blood? It's, it's just the bandage. I don't see blood. You can see the blood seep through the bandage. Just, I don't just see any blood you know. from here. No. Can just cover the blood and just so they can okay, see the impact wound. There's a bandage wound. on me. What the heck in yeah. dog? Yeah, so, so what happened? I was, okay, so <laughs> I went to a party on Saturday night. My friend and I went back to the house that she's dog sitting at. Um, she was told that the dog um, had previous trauma, but the owners didn't tell her that she couldn't let the dog out to go to the bathroom if she brought someone over. And it had been a few hours, so it was time for the dog 
to go to the bathroom. And as soon as she opened the door of the crate, the dog, instead of going straight out to the backyard, took a detour and came straight for me. And I like knew what was happening because I was being charged by a pit bull. So I was just like kind of yelling and then it got a hold of my arm. And the only thing I could think of to say was, I just like told my friend to let her know it was an emergency. I just screamed, it's happening. And then she like grabbed the dog oh off of me and I ran into the kitchen bleeding. I don't know why, but the I don't know why. I'm sorry to laugh at your trauma, <laughs> but you screaming, it's happening. <laughs> as your first response to being attacked by a dog is so I think, I think crazy. it's because I was thinking in my head, is this well, gonna happen? Is this gonna happen when the dog yeah. was coming to me? Yeah. Um, but yeah, then I went straight to the ER and I was there from like, the, it was a long wait, so I was there from two to 10 in the morning. Like, so they make your ass wait in the lobby with <clears throat> your arm all fucked up? Um, <clears throat> well, first they wrapped me, and then um, I waited for like two hours, and they took me to the back to a bed, mm -hmm. and then I waited. And I got like IVs, tetanus shots, all this okay. stuff. Okay. Yeah. Wow, that's scary, and a pit bull. I mean, that's Bro. the scariest dog. Yeah. Big one? Uh, yes, I didn't realize, however, how serious people are about the pit bull smear campaign. I only wrote that a pit bull was there and that was the dog that bit me to let people know that it was big. Yeah. I didn't want people to think that I was like a pussy and saying, oh, no, a pit bulls are an important detail. They're scary. Yeah, as shit. they're scary. Yeah. But no, I, d I don't think that it's because this dog was a pit bull. I think that the owners just didn't instruct my friend properly. <clears throat> For, I mean, that's, yeah, I mean, that is terrible dogsmanship. Yeah. They, were, they were cool with the, the babysitter, the dog was? Yeah, the babysitter, they apparently, she went over and met him when the owners were still there and she was totally fine. Holy fuck, did she warn you that there was a crazy dog in the house? No, or I mean, like she, she told me that she was dog sitting and that's why she was oh there. Oh my God. And so the dog locked onto your arm? Bro, it hurt so bad. Like, as soon as he clamped, because it, he tried to go for my pocket and I had like my wallet or something. And so there are little holes in the pants I was wearing there. And so he moved up then to my arm. Mm -hmm. And as soon as he latched on, he just went like harder and harder. And it hurt so bad. Were you thrashing around and the dog was? No. No. I think I was just like going like this and it grabbed. And then it happened so fast. Like, maybe three seconds five seconds it was on me oh my god yeah and then did you did she what did she do with the dog put it outside just back in the crate back in the crate yeah. and then did what did she call the owners you called the police you no, called 911. i called my my dad yeah. so i was freaking out bleeding called my dad he came right to me and then he took me to the er so he was he was a champ he stayed with me the whole time too thank good you dad. chris wad wad good man <laughs> That's I'm a good dad, dad right there. Good pops. Um, God, that's terrifying. That's so fucking scary, dude. Thank you. It's okay. I have a story now. Now I seem kind of brave. As soon as it doesn't hurt anymore. She I showed us hurt. like the wound, and it's so deep. And you really are so brave, Olivia. Thank I don't you, know Lena. How, like, you dealt with that. <laughs> I can't even imagine. I already shit my pants, Thank but you. Pitbull was charging me. Mm -hmm. It's really deep. You had to get stitches. It, well, they can't give stitches on high risk injuries. So What's like a high risk injury? dog bites because there's so much bacteria on the dog. So I'm still bleeding. Oh, because like, it might yeah. get infected and they mm -hmm. might need to treat it. Yeah. So apparently they only stitch dog bites when it's cosmetic or something because it's going to scar. So. so they. Wow. So you just have an open fucking wound. Mm -hmm. I'm just bleeding out over here. But shit. <laughs> what but kind of pain meds they hook you up so, with? Yeah. What? What kind of pain meds they hook you up with? Narco. Okay. Nice. So I'm feeling pretty good about <laughs> it. <laughs> nice, nice. Dude, that's crazy. Yeah. It's happening. And what's with the dog? They're not going to kill the dog or anything, Absolutely are they? not. Yeah, okay. No. The people haven't reached out to me yet. Dude, that's crazy. I know. The same fucking thing happened when I got attacked by those two German shepherds. Yeah. Fuck. Owner never fucking reached out to me. And I spent all night trying to rescue those fucking yeah. dogs, man. I don't want to sue. I don't want to do anything. I would like an apology, though. If I don't have it, it makes me bitter and it makes me yeah, want to sue. Yeah, just apologize, <laughs> man. Yeah. I think they're afraid of getting sued, so they're like, better just not to say anything. I guess. But I don't know. No. If they say sorry, I won't. Oh, there it is. You heard it here first. On camera. Otherwise, go straight to Sal Goodman. Yeah. Or, like, you go cow style. I just want to make a quick note <laughs> that uh, Howie's TikTok is still up. I don't know why that link... Wait, what's it? So, so wait, send me the link again. Okay. One sec. 
So lots of blood. Was it like gushing? Yeah. Was it bleeding? It, it was bad. looked super deep. Do you want to see? If I can send you photos. Yeah, send me the photo. I'll I'll, t I'll describe it. Fuck. That's Donnie? scary. Oh. Oh, here it is. Yeah, that was weird. It still says not. It doesn't work for me. Are you sure it's not cached or something on yours? Uh, no. It look. It just says something went wrong. No, I'm just on the TikTok app. It's, How he blocked you? It's working for me. All right, let me just go to. <laughs> what if he blocked you because you kept fucking? <laughs> I'm not. I don't think I'm even logged in on this one. Okay. Is it? It's this one. Today we're going to talk about what yeah, yeah, it's, it's something went wrong for me too when I hit this app. Yes. It says never forget Howie. I love the comments. Oh, I just knows that's Young Gravy. At at the top of the comments. It is. Oh shit, <laughs> Young Gravy, my man. Did we talk about it with Young Gravy? I must have. I think so, yeah. <clears throat> I must have. Who have you not talked yeah, about I it with? Yeah, I must have. A single, uh, a, the digital footprint has already been spread everywhere. It ain't going, and we ain't never forgetting, Howie. Yo. How's Neil doing? <laughs> You'll never forget. <laughs> no, you're a legend for that one. It's amazing. I love it. There's a whole culture. It's a cult mm -hmm. around Howie's prolapse post. Ah, what a guy. Great facial hair, by the way, on Howie. Ow. You send me the photo? Yeah. All right, let me take a look. I'm trying to save it. Art in Discord, maybe? So my phone is on TikTok. Yeah. What was the dog's name? Piper. Oh, I thought it'd be Donnie. something cute, like Tulip or something. <laughs> Donnie? Dumbass name. Dumbass name. Piper. Piper. <laughs> Idiot dog. Ooh, yeah, that's a... Okay, here's the photo. Oh, shit. Yeah. That's a dues. Whoa. I'm sending a few so you can see the dimensions. Yeah, send me more. Scooby Dooby Doo. <laughs> the inappropriate <laughs> Scooby. Please. <laughs> no. Yo, Scooby Doo would be a lot different show if Scooby had some balls fucked people up like this. He's like, yeah, I mean, he's a great Dane. Yeah, that's a deep ass. There's like a bunch of deep ass tooth oh. gashes in your arm. Fuck you up. Yeah, you can see where like. His teeth tried to grab me and then like pulled. Holy uh, yeah, yeah, shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, it's fucked. Do you have a pet? I wonder why he thought yeah, he was two, so threatened I by you. I have two dogs yeah. and I was oh, on my way to like sit down on the floor to be less threatening too. You probably would have gone for your face. Can you imagine? You he smelled not. your dogs probably. Maybe. Yeah. It's right. all Bowie's fault. Bitch. The chat's asking for you to post it on Twitter. I don't know if you oh. want to. Uh, sure. I yeah, mean, post I it on our podcast Twitter. Yeah, post it to the pod Twitter. All cool. right. Yeah, you got it, love. I don't. I don't think it's it's not that. Okay. Um, it's not as bad as a prolapse anus. No, it's not definitely at all. not as bad as that. Shit. It Sadly. is not as bad as that. It's it's not super gory, but so you can tell it, it looks like it's already been cleaned, right? At this point, yeah, yeah. it had been cleaned, yeah. I think, twice. Yeah. Whew. Oh man, that's scary. Well, I'm glad you're okay. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, on the uh, on the weekend, Olivia just dropped. <laughs> in the chat, guys, I just got a serious. I think I just got seriously attacked by a dog or something. Yeah, we were talking about God of War. It was like 2 a.m. Yeah. Like, guys, I got bit. I'm like, oh, you're playing too? She's like, no, by a pit bull. Mm -hmm. Fuck. You think pet, do pit bulls get bad reps? I don't know. They didn't do. We, didn't apparently. we read a statistic that like a large portion of all dog attacks are from pit bulls? I'm not like kill pit bulls. That's not my thesis at all. I'm just saying. We did have a discussion. I don't remember what the exact statistic was, but we did have a discussion about it. Fact check that. I remember it was some like yeah. staggering percentage of dog attacks. Oh, Mr. Beast just passed uh, PewDiePie? That was fast, Jesus. That was fast as shit, dude. 111 cool million? One. Tomorrow, you said. PewDiePie has... Oh yeah, no, he did. He just passed him. Love. I prefer really not to. Yeah, I said uh, that's not cool, dude. Oh, that's not cool. It's fucked up. Yeah, I knew that whole subscribe to PewDiePie thing was a sham. And now look at him. Yeah. He used us, us Swedish people. Did you post okay. it on Twitter? Uh, yeah, I just did. Yeah, so you guys can go check out the uh, the results here, but man, Donnie. You'll have some cool scars. 
Yeah, I'll feel good about it. Yeah, you know, I already feel dope. good telling the story. Your aren't you have good mobility, no permanent yeah, it's damage. Totally fine. No, it's, good. it's just sore. That's good. Nice. Mm-hmm. All right. Well, we're all glad you're okay. That was a very an eventful, uh, scary, but good. But glad you're okay. <laughs> but good. Yeah, not good and like not good, but good. You know. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Dude, I'm freaking scared. Uh, between 2005 and 2017, 65 percent of total uh, dog attacks were from pit bulls. That seems so insanely high. I almost don't believe it. Yeah, I mean, there are some websites that are discrediting that. I know it's all over the place because some people are, but that same website is saying because not all these dogs should be identified as pit bulls. But I've seen what it. website is that? Uh, the one that says it is 65. Yeah. Uh, Shoe House Law. That's a law website. Yeah. Does he specialize in dog attacks? <laughs> I think so. <laughs> that uh, the, the one that hey, I saw Olivia, is... Olivia, we just found you some representation. Oh, my God. <laughs> Wait dog. for me to reach out. <laughs> this is from is, uh, Statistica. Okay. No, it says the source is dogsbite.org. <laughs> Dogsbite.org. <laughs> Wait, what goes on on dogsbite.org? Let's What's find the out. Dogs statement? Bite yeah. A list dot of every dog. dog. <clears throat> uh, dog bite victims. There's some serious dog haters. It's about pretty much what you would Don't expect. Dog <laughs> bite victims. Dog. What are you trying to do? What do you want us to kill all dogs? <laughs> That's all I'm saying. Dogbite.org is a national dog bite victim group dedicated to reducing serious dog attacks. We conduct research on the growing but underreported public safety issue of severe fatal dog attacks inflicted by dangerous dog breeds. We champion the rights of victims through our research, education, and advocacy. Okay, seems legit. <clears throat> so here, this is interesting. Pit bulls, number one by far. Now, is that the result of a pit bull being an aggressive dog or like psychotic People that like aggressive dogs tend to get pit bulls. <clears throat> I've always, yeah. I think it's probably a combination of the two. It, it, they, the, those two things that you just named play off each other in mm -hmm. such a way. Yeah, a lot of rescued pit bulls were fighting dogs. So, like, they're literally trained to kill. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean, Shredder bites people every day. And so I don't see him on this. <laughs> I don't see Yorkies on the list. <laughs> Well, I think that's part of it too. Is you know the you know, pit bull's uh, bite is so powerful that when it he, does attack, it is much more likely for it to be severe and somebody end up hospitalized. So it probably is significantly underreported for small dogs because yeah, small dogs uh, they they bite this, too. If Shredder had a stronger jaw, we we'd have been sued into oblivion by now. <laughs> let, me, let me tell you straight up, that dog is a menace. Yeah, uh, Rottweiler. Much less wa uh, Wallace. Yeah, Wall. Yeah. Wallace is a fucking Bad problem, dog. too. <laughs> Rottweilers, German Shepherds, the two dogs almost killed me, and Shredder. I have a German Shepherd. Mixed breed? How are they just going to shit on mixed breed? Isn't that like a... I guess that's like all other dogs. Your, your mom just messaged me. Did she already hear me say that about Wallace? She's coming to her defense? Oh, no, <laughs> it's unrelated. <laughs> She said, I read 25% were pit bulls with Labrador, uh, Labrador's second in bites. No, Labradors are not the aggressive. The, uh -huh. Where'd she get her stats? Not dogsbites.org. <laughs> I'm not sure. She just, <laughs> she just sent me that message. I'll probably get another one about Wallace in a second, though, since I mentioned that. So anyway, okay, well, there you go. We got to the bottom of it. Uh, for more info, go to dogsbite.org. <laughs> Uh, we're changing the world for the better over there. <sighs> Moving on. <clears throat> uh, excuse me. Goddamn. I haven't been smoking or anything, but I think it's the weather change. I've had the heater on in my house, and my nose, I'm just bleeding from my nose all the time. I got bloody bugs. I'm coughing. You just get, you just randomly get in nosebleeds from the, it's from the furnace. Sure, the yeah, because it gets all dry. Yeah, <laughs> huh. I can't think of the last time that that happened to me. When I was a kid, I used to get nose. I, you know, most kids do. I used to get nosebleeds all the time. Yeah, I genuinely can't remember the last time that's happened. It, that your nose just randomly is like, oh, I'm bleeding now. It's not like when I was a kid where it was just be like a waterfall of blood. Sure, yeah, it's pretty. It, you know, huh? There's lots of blood in my nose all the time. Blood boiling. <laughs> Yo, I saw I got an email from Jimmy Lee today. <laughs> what day do you not? Well, that's kind of what I was wondering. He <laughs> sent me an email about something like 
that he was going to be in L.A. and that uh, he's my best friend and uh, let's do something exciting together. And I decided to search his email and lo and behold, since I've known Jimmy, he's, he's emailed me 374 times as Jimmy Lee. And that then seems at, low. Really? I don't know. I had pages and pages and pages, bro. That's 50 emails per page. I had to click a lot of times to get to the back. Sure, but I mean, that... You've known him for what, five, six years now? Something like that? I guess well, maybe even longer? Steve Holy Rossi has emailed me 44 times. Oh, of course, of course. His of course. Uh, elusive publicist mm -hmm. for a total of like, what is that, 430 or something? Okay, yeah, we're getting. That's a lot of fucking emails, dude. He must have called me uh, 20 times over the weekend. See, this is why really? I'm saying it seems low. It's based he off the volume of. Uh, Calls he really called you that many times? He's Open your missed call. Do you answer them or do you? Fuck do you, no. Yeah. <laughs> he he was he was in town. Um, you know I'll text him. I'll keep tabs on him, but you'll never be able to get off. So how many missed calls you get from him? Go. Um, uh, let's get the exact number. Okay, let's see. Uh, it's an old timey one, thing. One, two, three, four, <laughs> five. I was exaggerating, but okay. five is a five lot. is still a five lot. Missed calls. <laughs> five. Since, since um, Friday. And then an un uh, like just kept texting me pictures, memes that he posts. So he'll like send it to me after he posts it. Yeah, he he emails me the memes a lot. Yeah, Zach, you you actually respond <coughs> to him, but I don't, and he still sends me on the mailing list there. So like I get everything <laughs> he posts on his Instagram. He's so it. fantastic. How can you dislike Jimmy Lee? The man is like. <laughs> He's a force of nature. There's nobody like him in the whole planet. So <laughs> this he, man has emailed me like 430 times, bro. So he messaged me. Saturday was, "Are you going out tonight with gang?" I said, "Are you in LA?" He's all, "Come today. Need FOMO with you. <laughs> <laughs> come out. Come with us tonight. Big Daddy need the Zacker." Then he sent me a picture. <laughs> Big Daddy need the. Zacker. I said, "Who's going?" He said, "I got Polly and Pat." My buddy. It's Polly and it's Pat. Polly hey, Pat. hey, meet me at the hey, Oh, I remember the email he sent me. He said, bring the cameras. Let's go to a restaurant. I'm going to tear that place up. I'm going <laughs> to go in the kitchen and make a crazy FOMO for you guys. Then he said, bring one of your buddies, probably Shoshone's, which is the restaurant he was going to. Need Zach on team, kid. Get AB. We're going to Shoney's. Get the team together. <laughs> We're gonna create some FOMO. Did he refer? Did I understand that he referred to himself as Big Big Daddy in one of those? Uh, come out with us tonight, Big Daddy. I think he called he was, Zach. He was Big referring Daddy. to me as Big yeah. Daddy. Yeah. Okay. Um, and then it, I said, "I'll let you know. I'll keep you posted." <laughs> he said, "Dope it is. Dope on a rope with some soap." He's always on, even in text. And then the last text was FOMO Hotel made that Craig's tonight major FOMO. <laughs> no, Zach, you're missing out on our group chat one, too. Oh, shit, there's another yeah. chat, too. He says, Zach, we're insulting all the customers, and they're dying laughing. Where are you? <laughs> this is, <laughs> this is major FOMO. Major. All caps, major. Why, what is this? Why is it saying more posts from Jimmy Lee? I just want Jimmy Lee. Hold it. I click in this link you sent, AB, and it, did he rate? Okay, here, goddamn. What does it do that? You see that? Yeah. So you guys saw that. So I'm not crazy. You're not crazy. I saw it. Getting FOMO over here. Yeah. See it? What the fuck? What kind of FOMO just is this? Go to his profile. Yeah, I just, yeah, I just sent you his profile link. Yeah, Jimmy's been posting. <laughs> <laughs> he hasn't missed a day on the memes, man. Although, Jimmy, if I'm be honest, dude, and I know you're probably watching this, listen, you on horseback ushering Native Americans on the Trail of Tears is yeah. not funny. The wounded knee is not something that you like, want to joke about. You have to know that. The Native Americans is the probably the single biggest genocide in American history. So let's not laugh about the Trail of Tears, okay? Yeah. It's just not cool. Listen, Jimmy, you handing a a blanket with smallpox <laughs> is really not a good vibe, bro. He has a new Breaking Bad post with Walter Jr. now becoming Heisenberg. Dude, this man posts so much. Like, what the fuck? Where's the one? You gotta keep going. Look at this shit. The Jake Paul Andrew Tate <laughs> meetup. What the fuck, man? How are you so active on here? He's got a team of like twenty people. He, said. he does. Dude, like, that's it's like insane. <laughs> but these people he's hired are actually like really internet savvy. That's the weird part. 
I know they're fans. No, I think of it's ours. just fans. Yeah. I think it's just fans sending it in. It, it's definitely fans, people's... but the they're really deep fried, high level memes. You handled the chip, Dan. Have you tried D's? <laughs> <laughs> I shot that I like one that awake. <clears throat> Get in, loser. We're making FOMO. So there, there was another text he sent me that I'd like to read. I said, I, after the, I'll keep you posted, he said, Come on, pal, how many times can you say you hang out with a real celebrity? Referring to him? Referring to him. He's kidding. He's gotta be. I don't know anymore, dude. <laughs> it's, it is hard to tell. Rory Hicks, thank you, man. What's this about the stolen car? Let me know if you want the mole peeps to build you an underground drilling submarine. Yeah, that's Rory, our resident thank mole you. man. I'll, I'll get to the, uh, thank you for the dono. I'll get to the, um, the stolen car here in a minute. Yeah, it fucking sucks. I forgive you for all the things you never apologize for. Uh, Dan, he forgives you for saying you don't like him. Me? Let me yeah. see. Which one are you looking at? Right here. He says, I forgive you for all the things you never apologize for. <laughs> Sorry. These are all okay. Oh, I actually, I, I actually really like the, uh, Yo, the God it, of War one that he posted. I wait, put it, it on my story. It will not let me open this image. This is the one that bugged out. It's cursed. Okay, I'll Maybe just go zoom to the in. One next to it. Look, and... I'll just zoom in. There it is. <laughs> it's awesome. Bro, we can't play it. It's cursed. It's too much. You know what would be epic if Jimmy paid to promote this? Oh, yeah. Oh, That'd yeah. be a high level play. No, he's going to do that. <laughs> do it, man. <laughs> Where's the God of War one? I'll just look at one more here. Uh, keep going. Keep going. Right there. there in the middle. Got a uh, FOMO. Got a FOMO. <laughs> Cease these old timey jokes, boy. Father, when can I go out on my own? I've got the whole it's world the Pinocchi- to spread FOMO. The Pinocchio. It's a uh... father. When father. Can I go on my own? <laughs> Dude, these meme makers are wild as shit. <laughs> I don't know what to say about it, but okay, there it is. So shout out Jimmy. Is he still in L.A., uh, Zach? I believe so. Yeah, yeah. I can feel his presence. <laughs> I mean, he knows where we work. Is he going to show up and just shout our names? Now he's going to. <laughs> I mean, that's, I'll let him in if he does that. Uh-oh. You're not invited, but if you can post up outside and get our attention, you can come in. <laughs> you know? <clears throat> there it is. <clears throat> Wait a minute. He <laughs> Check out Jimmy Lee's story. <laughs> Looks like he's posing up with a sack. <laughs> His story. Oh, Can I look at stories on on? <laughs> yeah, I think so. Yeah. It's like a sack look alike. Oh, every time. Well, yeah. He Wait, he got a replacement sack. <laughs> yeah, it's like a sack look alike, dude. He gets he gets <laughs> recognized a lot now in public because uh, <laughs> his time on the show, and he just yeah, he he likes to hit the buttons. <laughs> That's funny. Oh my god. <laughs> um. Oh, this this um floated to the top of our subreddit, and I totally fucking forgot about this. Holy shit! Yeah, the first comment is, "How do people find this?" And that's the truth of it. Ethan Klein's school picture showing he was in Jesus Christ Commitment Club. Dude, I forgot about this shit. This is crazy. Blast from the past. Totally committed is a club. For those who are ready to display their relation to Jesus Christ and make a commitment to serve him completely. This club organization, uh, uh, commemoration, Christmas child, I, I, it's cut off. Jesus, it's Members can also be seen spreading candy canes at Christmas time and treating treats for teachers during teacher appreciation. I don't know, whatever. Week. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, so, I don't know why it looks so small. <laughs> Yeah, so, I think what happened was, I heard that it was during yearbook, um, day at school, Mm -hmm. and all the groups and clubs, and I heard that Jesus Appreciation Club was (laughs) getting together for the yearbook in the the gymnasium, and I just decided to show up for the lulls, just (laughs) for the photo. (laughs) Then none of them knew me, I'd never been there, and they all let me sit, and it was a really small club, they let me sit in. How did they let you... Bro, they let me sit in. They didn't say shit. That's so weird. And the thing, I guess everybody knew I was Jewish. I had like, the, I was kind of like, 
And my whole routine back then was just like, oh, I'm Jewish. Huh. So everybody knew I was Jewish. Gotcha. And I... Boy, you're boy. Maybe they were afraid of being like... They were like, is this offensive? Is this anti-Semitic if we kick him out? <laughs> I guess just let him take right. the photo. People didn't even think about what if anti-Semitism was a thing. Yeah, no, that's true. I think they were just, I don't know. I didn't think about it. I just thought it'd be fun. I was crazy, bro, back then. I had no boundaries. <laughs> now what? Compared, it, yeah, as opposed to now. <laughs> yeah. You've really reined it in in <laughs> your then, uh, you later days. Back then you sat in on a photo and smiled. I don't know. It's pretty, cr but ugh, shit, I don't know. There's a teacher here. Bunch of kids I never fucking met. And I went by myself, just cruised in, sat down. <laughs> yeah. Just Both for the low. You to like sit in the middle, kind of. Dude, that takes balls. And the front. Man. Right next to the teacher. <laughs> that takes crazy. balls. You know? I mean, if you do it with enough confidence, you know, sometimes people are that, like, that's great. No wonder you can nail the preacher voice so well. You studied <laughs> yeah. it. I was going to say, I wonder if any of these kids baby. have seen you do your preacher voice now and uh, recognize you. I hope not. Damn. So your name is not is not on there anywhere. So someone finding this is pretty impressive, man. I think I'm assuming that here. Let me go to the next page. What is this? Oh yeah, just a zoom in of me. What a psycho! <laughs> so funny. It was funny though. I totally forgot about this. <laughs> uh, I'm assuming they have copies of all the years book years, and someone was just flipping through my grad year, which is like 2004. No. Three, you right? Wait, from, from high school? I was 05, and I believe you're yeah. two years older than me, so. Or wait, aren't you like six no. years, seven years older than me? No. 42 no, 40, minus 35? No, no, yeah, no, that's no. seven. 37. 42 today. <laughs> 42 today! It's not, my birthday's in June. I mean, you can Google it. All right, that's enough. Cut it, Zach. It's just, you know what more. I mean? I'm, I'm sensitive, and you guys, you know, it just throws me off. It's just, I'm 37, so. <laughs> so, yeah, you must have been 03. For your I don't think I graduated in 03. I think it was 04. Okay. If your birthday is late in the year sometimes. Yeah, June. Maybe you were only one grade ahead of, of me. Year. Yeah. It was in also, June also, this year. Also, my mom held me back between kindergarten. I tell that story. My mom literally said, you fail kindergarten. My teacher failed me in kindergarten. Right. Then you're too fucking dysfunctional. That. <laughs> that explains it then, yeah. Yeah, 2004. So there it was. And my maturity really shows, doesn't it, folks? That's crazy. There it is. There That's it is. That explains the... G so their comments were pretty funny, though. Someone's like, he was definitely there for a girl. Which is funny, because I was in another club for a girl I didn't give a fuck about. What, what club? But it, it wasn't like religious shit, it was like, uh, what the fuck was it? Still curious what you got roped into for a girl. <sighs> I almost got rep roped into uh, academic decathlon for a girl once. <laughs> I can't fucking believe Wait, what that. what is academic decathlon? That's like the, the like academic like competition where uh, it, like schools around the country compete in like, you know, Trivia, essentially. Oh, okay. Uh, not just trivia, but you know, uh, and yeah, I, I was seeing a girl that was in there, and she tried really hard to get me to join, but it's nope, nope. I, I think it was like nerd shit. I think it was like the lamest shit, like the Rotary Club. <laughs> the Rotary like, Club, so yeah. Dumb. I didn't know why any of these people were wasting their fucking time there. <laughs> it's like the dumbest shit, dude. The Rotary. We had to uh, start a club in high school. Like that was like our senior year. We had to start a club. It's cool if it's your own club. Like, yeah. what club did you make? The Rock and Roll Appreciation Club. There you go. <laughs> See, that's vibes. You know. So yes, I'm committed to Jesus Christ, as everybody well knows. Actually, I want to point out before we get too deep in it. Last year, we um, we put out sets of trading cards that did extremely well. It was a super mega hit. This year, the trading cards are back and better than ever. <laughs> Just like last year. Let's go! 100% of the profits is going to the crew. Yeah, boy! And uh, the cards are so beautiful. Let me open them up. Do I have an overhead cam? Yeah, let me, let me show you guys. This is available. At um, you know, I'll, we'll spam the link, and it's also in the description. It's uh, trading dot shop t r d n g dot shop. Now, 
I don't want to. There's a prolapse one in here, and I don't want to show even the blurred one. So I need to be careful about where that one's located. Okay, I think it's, it's the very last yeah, one. Yeah, I see. Yeah, so, um, oh, we're also selling the first pack. Interesting. So we're, it, what's cool about this one, too, here, I'll do open this like a Pokemon thing, uh, is that there's rare cards that aren't in every pack. The Golden Prolapse. We have here, I'm not going to show you because it's still graphic, but here you have my friend Neil. <laughs> And then we have the uncensored gold one, and it's in a protected 18 plus case. It's gorgeous. The creator, by the way, Max is with us. Hey, everybody. It's me. I made it. The god of trading. Yeah, so let's take a look here at, the, at this year's pack. 100% goes to the crew, guys. Ethan, Apology Podium. And they're all, how do you call this? Hologram? Holographic? holographic. Yeah, holographic. And those are premium, right? Of course. Yeah. Pre Only the best for you. Thanks, Sheesh. bro. Here's Ela, the X Factor. Reel it in. Holographic, baby. Dan. Oh, this one's sick. Scorpion chair. That looks like a real magic card. Yeah, dude. And shout out to Cam. He did most of the art on the squares. Oh, he yeah. Came out great. Cam, you did great. Yo, Zilly Zonk. This looks oh, like a rare card. No way, dude. That's powerful, man. Zach pranks your opponent by awarding. Them with a factory of rotten fruit lowering their morale this turn. They're fucking loser piece of shit. 180 HP. Let's go! <laughs> AB. Bongo Boxer. Oh, that's quite nice. I like the the, yeah. the marrying of the two worlds. Olivia Delete it bald. Olivia exposes your opponent's hairline, lowering their morale and causing them to have a hard time the rest of the weekend. Delete it, bald. Ian, the thinker. Whoa. Love that. Cameron, bunny hop, a.k.a. like uh, Snow White vibes. She's the critter princess, right? Yeah. Yes. Do you feel like Snow White <laughs> ever can? I wish. No. A little bit. When I feed squirrels, I do. There you go. Love, oh yeah, dude. This is everything. Hell yeah, baby. Darn garden. Dude. Dog, mate. She. <laughs> Sam. Anyone here the... from Arizona? Oh, this is a um, Fortnite reference, and also, but you also do build here on the show. That's a nice one there, Sam. Lena, the Spice Queen. True, although she was dethroned by Dan, but we don't need to talk about that, right, Lena? To be determined. Yeah, it was... she. That's true. Yeah. Okay, fair enough. Yeah, we'll see. This is so beautiful. Oh my god. <laughs> this is so sweet. Guard puppies, Alfredo and Alfredo. Dog responsible for most dog attacks in America, right here. Shredder. <laughs> Families. Yeah. That's so nice. Boomer bash. Leftovers. That would be Hassan uh, penetrating me from behind. I'm very proud of that okay. shot. Pride Minute, I love this. 60 second celebration, guys. Celebrate Pride Minute with us here at the HG Podcast. AB's Burrito, oh yeah, that's a special, that's a highly coveted card. Fuck yeah. And technical difficulties. Uh, and of course the prolapse here. These, all, all the profits, guys, 100% of our cut goes to the crew. Very exciting. And so stuff. there's there's a censored prolapse card in every pack. Every pack has the same 18 yeah. cards. 18 and then we have a thousand gold uncensored prolapse cards that we're just going to put in the bubble mailers. The golden ticket. It, and then we have oh, yeah. one golden ticket that we're inserting in one of the packs. And we th going to give a massive grand prize to someone. I'm not sure... Yet, I think it depends where you live. Like, if you're in America, we're thinking, oh, we'll fly out to the show, put you up, and you can be part of the show if you want. You know? Uh, so, or, but if you're like, if you're in like Serbia or some shit, like, we just, just feel like it gets a little complicated at that point. We love our Serbian fans, though. No, no, we do, but maybe I'll do something else for you. I don't know. We'll try to make it work if you're in Serbia. <laughs> but I'm not, I don't make a promise to the Serbians. Yeah. 
uh, the the uh, golden prolapse comes in this. So, in care and consideration, that nobody has their. If only Howie opened his TikTok with this, am I right? Congrats! Oh. Inside of this protective protector lies the elusive and rare golden prolapse card. This really is an uncensored prolapse anus inside of this protector. Seriously. There's an 18 plus card. You have been warned. Please do not open this unless you want to see a uncensored prolapse anus. Peace and love, peace and love. <laughs> Ethan, you can probably pull out just the name, like just Let's see half an inch of it. True, 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 true. Just That's the best part is you can really... Uh, okay, so I can do like, yeah. do like this. Yeah. But it's golden. My friend Neil. You can see a little bit of the staining. Hundreds. You all know what comes next. <laughs> the gold really brings out the uh, crevices, I feel. Yeah. It's actually quite nice the way you guys framed it, where the prolapse is over the frame. Thank it's you. beautiful. Thank you. Really yeah. classy. We, we went through eight or nine different design drafts over the last couple of months for just the gold prolapse card. Oh, it's, really it's, it's, it's gorgeous. It. It's really, you guys topped, uh, really topped yourselves this year, so... Head on over to uh, uh, trading, spelled T-R-D-N-G dot shop. Links in the description. And we have, um, we just had a couple left over of the um, the first pack. The oh, okay. So so there's like 400 left. Those are going to go really quickly. They were just uh, some extras. We have 2,500 in stock, and those are going to go out for Christmas. And then we're going to open a pre-order until December 3rd at 11:59. Eastern Standard Time, and then after that, you will not be able to get these anymore. So, yeah, just to reiterate, if you order within the first 2,500 packs, you will get it before Christmas. Yes. Those are made that is, that is, and ready to go. That is the goal with international shipping, obviously. some Domestic, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah that's a good point. Yeah. If you're, if you, again, live in Serbia, let's temper our expectations, okay? You live in Serbia, for Christ's sake. But to or everyone who herbs. lives domestically, you're going to get those uh, in, in before Christmas. Now, you can buy, if you're past 2500 you can buy. It's going to remain open for pre-sales. Mm -hmm. and there's going to be a lot, so feel free to pre-sale. And then we're going to close it, the pre-sale. December 3rd at 11.59 Eastern Standard Time. Yeah. And then those will all ship out to you guys um, Q1, so like January, February. There it is. There it thank is. Thank you, thank you. So this is exciting. Once again, all the profits that we get are going straight to the crew. So that is a beautiful thing. So we love them. And in, that, the, that in the last seven days, Ethan, Yeah. we have had uh, 6,136 views from Serbia, just so you know. <laughs> uh, that's why I'm calling them out. I'm saying, hey, if you get that golden ticket in Serbia, we'll talk. But I think I'm comfortable saying if you're domestic, we'll bring you out to the show. We'll put you up and um, we'll have Jimmy Lee roast you or something. I don't know. Also, I wanted to shout out one more thing. At the live show, we have these brand new cards. Whoa. These are exclusive for the live show. The art's done by Day Off Limited on Instagram. They've worked with some of my favorite creators before. Wait, are we selling this at the live show? You couldn't really see that. Oh, show. Dude, here, that, oh, pass there's it to no me. camera here. <laughs> I'm putting it. Yeah, just show it up to the camera. God. The design is so dope. They killed it. They are the best. Please follow them. I, oh, uh, I have the green screen on, so this was a bad choice too, but you get the <laughs> idea. It's the same as the poster that we released. Oh, show the me. back, Dan. So yeah, we're... Um, we're working on Let's post it. We'll too. post the image online sure. so people can see. It, but um, people are wonder, saying, "How do the how do we put in the golden ticket? Is that going to be in the first twenty five hundred, or how we, how are we going to decide on the golden ticket?" It'll probably be in the first twenty five hundred if it's for the live show. Um, so, right. So people get it in time. Okay. So, yeah. Again, that makes sense. The first twenty five hundred are going to sell out quickly, and then the shop will update and it'll say pre order, so you'll know exactly what you're going to be in. So, if you really want something for Christmas, um, they're they're almost we're almost out of the twenty five hundred. So wow! Really? Right? Yeah. Crazy. Wait, how much? How much is a pack? Twenty five dollars. Twenty five bucks. And you get all eighteen cards in every single pack. So there's they're not random. The only thing that's random is these the golden prolapse the one. so yeah the lucky thousand will get two prolapses one regular oh, and one golden to chair lucky, forever. How lucky. christmas is one day <laughs> christmas is one day yet the pro the gays got a whole <clears throat> month 
the lucky prolapse they will that will be spread out in both drops, right? Yes. Not only the two thousand. Yep. Yeah. And it, yeah, we're um we're over halfway sold out on the okay in stock ones. Okay, so, cool. So if you want to order. So once quick. again, if you want the chance to win the golden ticket, it's going to be in the first twenty five hundred, just because we want it to be for the live show. So there you have it. Um, and thank you, thank you, tra- rap trading, or sorry, you're trading now. The yep. rap got dropped. Why'd you drop the rap? I started off working in music, working with musicians, and then I worked Oh, with that's this, what... Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then I uh, ended up working with this little podcast with all these fun guys on it. And um, I've just been working with creators a lot recently. Are you talking about us? Yeah. yeah okay, you cool. Yeah. I was like, what are the... Being a little, like, being like a little cheeky. <laughs> being a little cheeky. Yeah, but um, but yeah, I'm, uh, since you guys have worked with really awesome creators like Nick is Not Green and Gabby Bell and um, just a bunch of people, if you are a creator and you want to work with me, reach out to me on my website. Um, but yeah, I, I'm super, super proud of these. Uh, Sam, thank you so much for being so amazing and helping me with this project. And it's just a, uh, it's a dream come true. I've been watching you guys for forever. So thanks, really bro. Happy. Yeah, you make awesome, a great man. product, man. I'm stoked on it. It's thanks, like man. so beautiful. It really is high level stuff. Thank you. And also, if if you email me or reach out to me or whatever, um, it's just me. I'm I'm the whole company. So um, <laughs> so yeah, just uh, appreciate the patience with everything and uh, yeah. Your customer support. I'm everything, bro. You got to get customer support. You just you just sold 2,500 packs. Yeah. You got to hire someone to answer emails. <laughs> I mean, you know. That's that's the goal. That's the okay. goal. I, All right. I, you know, I really want to build. That's this the thing. game. But um, yeah. Thanks for the support, that's guys. The I'm really happy. Everybody loves them. So. Yeah, I love Thank it. You. And, uh, by the way, love. You're saying that on the first drop is on eBay for 200 bucks? No. Did someone buy? It hasn't been sold, bucks? Yeah, but it's people... been posted uh, for 200 to 300 dollars. Wow. Mm. There's a resale market apparently. Very big. Yeah. So um, anyway, are those PSA rated? Oh, of course. Of course. Okay. They will, yeah, yeah. Didn't we try? Can we send the prolabs to get PCA rated? You know, <laughs> they I, rate that. The the Pokemon craze has uh, seemingly died down, so they probably have. Because um, the only reason we didn't remember we were going to get those um, Gulf War cards rated. Yes. But then PSA, the company that does that, literally closed submissions because it was becoming. Oh my They God. were completely overwhelmed. Yeah, with bro. Pokemon I wanted my card. I wanted my George Bush card rated, bro. Yeah, but uh, that was uh, over a year ago now, so they're they're probably so back in the game now. Pro- <laughs> get the they can be so rated. I mean, can, is that fucked up, or can we send the prolapse in to get rated? I I mean, it's a service without any it's like okay. warning. Although Howie showed it to all of us without any warning. Love says it's okay. What do you What do you it's think? It's okay. Come on. Just put like, oh, there's an ass in What here. do you think, Max? Whatever. Yeah, I mean, I, I, I don't know. I, my, I was surprised that my manufacturer uh, was cool making a thousand <laughs> golden they, Did they say anything? No. They didn't say shit. No, it actually it took a second. <laughs> uh, I had to like reprint them, and I really thought that they were just going to say no, and then we just weren't going to have them. But <laughs> I wonder how many people had to handle and look at those. I think a lot. With no explanation. <laughs> yeah, well, you know, like Dan said. You know, everybody had to see those. It's a job. I see somebody in the maybe. chat saying they only rate certain cards. You can't just send any card. Well, yeah, we need a petition going. Yeah, thing. let's, get, let's yeah. get them officially rated. Power to the people. So wait, do they? Uh, do we know if they rate the Gulf War? Pack? Well, those were like official tops <laughs> cards. So it, I mean, as funny as it is, maybe. <laughs> Man, the barricades. All right. Thank you to uh, thank you to Max. We'll, I'll keep promoting it and through uh, the end of December but yeah it goes all to the crew guys this is very cool very fun and uh, we love to support the crew here uh, uh, don't we folks? we do we love it we love it we um, will we be without our beautiful crew ladies and gentlemen I'll be paying them in fupa coin by the way the exchange rate has gotten very bad on that so <laughs> bear with me oh no this is Cameron meanwhile Cameron be like money H3 trading back. Uh, uh, money. <laughs> money. Uh, By the way, the, um, a lot of people in the chat were trying to give you an out that you misspoke and you meant Siberia, not Serbia, when you were. Uh... Wait, is Serbia not a country? No, it is. So what? what? So you did mean Europe. Serbia. What's wrong with Serbia? 
<laughs> There's nothing wrong it's with not Serbia. It's not very far away. It's just in Europe. I don't, yeah, okay. I mean, what the fuck? I'm just saying. Yeah, it could be Serbia. could be if fucking it's... Turkey. It could be Egypt. It could be Germany. I don't know. It's just It could be complicated. If you live in uh, Europe, you can uh, get to travel to the... Kazakhstan, H3, Siberia. Mm. Okay. Shit. <laughs> All right, we are we are uh, over for doing our ad, uh, so we should do that. Uh, we have one ad. Let me thank them, honey, and then we'll get back and talk about my car that was stolen. <sighs> I really don't. It's so fucked up. I just got that car. Dude. All right. Let's stop. So I'll just thank honey, and then we'll come back and get into it. Thank you so much to Honey. We love Honey. You'd have to be insane to be browsing without Honey. Literally nuts. Today's episode is sponsored by Honey, the easy way to save when shopping on your iPhone or computer. I save, me and Ela save like on a daily basis. Um, the codes work so widely on the internet that you're going to be getting those every day. In my experience. Um, and thanks to Honey. Searching for coupon codes is a thing of the past. Honey is the free shopping tool that scours the internet for promo codes and applies the best one it finds to your cart. Imagine you're shopping at one of your favorite sites and when you uh, click checkout, the Honey button appears and all you have to do is click apply coupon. Wait a few seconds as Honey searches for coupons it can find for that site. And if Honey finds a working coupon, you will watch the price drop magically. Furniture, food, computer parts, like clothing, the the savings are insane. And you just go to checkout. My favorite is I'm just shopping like normal. And then all of a sudden when you're getting ready to check out and pay full price, honey's like, uh, is there someone you forgot to ask? Like the consent meme. And uh, it's like, I agree on this price. They agree on this price. Honey, is there someone you forgot to ask? Yes. Honey just hit you with that $10 off coupon, that $5 off coupon, that, you know, in this case, $20 off coupon. And it's basically free money. I mean, it really is. It's so easy to use. It drops down. You click it. It automatically applies it. It's boom, bomb, bang, Bob's your uncle. You don't even have to think about it. Thank dude. you, Crowder. Uh, you can save even more when you ask Honey to keep track of price drops on your holiday shopping list. Hmm. If the price drops on anything on your list, you'll instantly get an alert to let you know. That's cool. You know you know how often Amazon messes with its prices? It's insane. Like, if you track the price of certain items on Amazon, it's going up and down all the time. Huge swings. So that's actually really useful there. If you don't already have Honey, you could be straight up missing out. And by getting it, you'll be doing yourself a solid and supporting this show. Thank you. I use Honey. I love Honey. And, um... So, get PayPal Honey? F get PayPal Honey for free? What does that mean? What does get PayPal Honey mean? You see that? Get PayPal Honey for free at joinhoney.com slash h3tv. What is PayPal Honey? Do you see that? I, I don't I don't know. Do you see what I'm talking about, though? Uh-huh, I see it, yeah. <laughs> okay, that's joinhoney.com. Slash H3. Uh, yeah, please support our sponsor. Honey is a great one, and we love them very much. So thank you, guys. Thank you. Thank you to Honey. We love you. Can you ask what's PayPal, Honey? That was like... I just, I'm sure they're going to let us know now. I got to know what that is. Well, I didn't do anything wrong. I still don't know what the fuck that is. Did you see it? I love Honey. Okay, let's talk about... Um, Let's talk about this shit. Um, actually, there's a... Daniel texts me. He was watching live. Oh, Honey joined he said, PayPal. He's saying it right. Family. PayPal Honey. Oh, that's... They changed their name. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. oh, okay. So that makes sense. Because they were calling it Honey the whole time, and then they drop a PayPal Honey at the end. Honey has joined the PayPal family. <laughs> PayPal Honey. Interesting. Hmm. That's interesting. All right, thank you, Daniel. I have handlers. They watch the show live to make sure. Yep. There's a team. They go, they go, Ida's doing the adries. Okay. They get the whole team watching. 
Actually, before I talk about my car being stolen, there's actually just a couple more things I want to hit on. Nick Cannon, we keep talking about how he's repopulating the earth. But the crazy thing is the names of his kids. Um, his name, the names of these kids is pretty wild. It's like he ran out of ideas when you have that many kids. Where's the list of names, guys? Can you just paste it in there for me? I, I don't see any names here. They're the bold on top of each one. Beautiful day. Or if you just want the subreddit meme, it's right here. Here is Monroe and Moroccan Scott. Hang on, I'll pull this one up. Yeah, this is better. So here is the name of Nick Cannon's children. And I get it. When you're having like, what is this, uh, nine? But well, he's got more than that. This is old. He's got like 14 now, doesn't he? Uh, he has 12. 12. Yeah. Uh, not all of them are born yet, though. So. Oh, oh, I see, I see. Okay. He has three cooking right now. Monroe Cannon, that's normal, that's nice. Age 11. Moroccan Scott Cannon. Fine. Moroccan's a little bit unusual, but it's not that. It's fine. Now this gets a little off the rails. Golden Sagan. Golden Sagan Cannon. That's a lot. <laughs> that's like a tongue twister. Yo, I got that Golden Sagan. What is Sagan? Is that something? I don't know what that is. It's probably Sagan. I would Golden say. Sagan? Sagan. Sagan, Sagan these nuts! nuts! <laughs> is that Ooh. what you're saying? Yep. Yeah. <laughs> yes, it was. Let's <laughs> fucking go right now, dude. Sorry. Yeah. Fucking go right now. So fucking hyped right now. This one's vibe. <laughs> Powerful Queen Cannon. That's when you're like totally out of ideas. That's, uh, that that's my finisher move on, on my mecha anime. <laughs> Powerful queen. Powerful queen. Powerful queen cannon! When your queen. name is a daily affirmation. <laughs> I am powerful queen. Mm -hmm. Good morning, my queen. So, so wait, what do we call her? Is it just power? Powerful queen? What do we call her? PQ? PQC? Pow? Pow pow? Then, I think he got a taste PQ. for a little bit of the wild side, because the pow, next pow. baby's name is Rise Messiah Cannon. In order, rise, Messiah. Mm -hmm. That's that's <laughs> wild, dude. I don't even know what the fuck, bro. Rise, Messiah. Clearly, the mothers have no uh, participation in these naming. Because these are Maybe. way these are way too. I think, in my opinion, there's a theme here, and he's the theme. There ain't no way these <laughs> mo different women are coming up with these crazy ass names. That's true. Rise Messiah. Uh, the next one, Zillion Hair, Zillionaire. She ain't gonna be, she ain't be inheriting no zillions if you keep having the kids at this rate. True. Three million dollars a year in child support. Money. <laughs> Money. Money. E even Elon Musk can support these many kids. Zion. Mixolydian. Mixolydian? <laughs> Wait, what <laughs> scale? What? Yeah, Mixolydian. Oh, it's a musical scale? Yeah. yeah. Zion, Mixolydian. Which makes sense for the second one, the one below it. Beautiful Zeppelin cannon. There we go. There, I love how he's just throwing in adjectives into the name now. <laughs> nice, nice <laughs> Zeppelin. Sweet, uh, cool Zeppelin. Funny Zeppelin. Let's see here. Zen Cannon. Okay, vibes. No middle name. Baby Cannon. You can't name your child Baby. That's horrible. You literally just forgot. He's at this point, he forgot. And he's just like, uh, Baby. I don't know. Fuck. Yeah. It's like when you baby name your too. dog, Dog. It's like, uh, that, Baby. That, that baby's that's not, not his born name. Yet. Yeah. That baby's not born yet. That's just Baby Cannon. Oh, thanks. Let's just forget about it then. <laughs> Well, why is, here it says? I mean, baby's more believable than half of these. Wait, but look, <laughs> the, the way it's formatted. It's because it's, it's matched okay, by mother. I, I wasn't trying. <laughs> Legendary love. That's pretty cool. That's a cool name. <laughs> That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Yeah. And then finally, um, Onyx Ice Coal Cannon. Onyx. They got four Did, names. This motherfucker just randomly picked words out of the dictionary. Onyx. <laughs> Just a random word generator. Come on, dude. Powerful Queen Cannon is sending me because it sounds like the name a unit of soldiers will call their cannon 
<laughs> during World War One or something. Powerful queen. Yeah, I just went to that website, Cam, uh, randomwordgenerator.com. Let's see. Yeah. Let's get uh, two random words cannon. Arena hair cannon. <laughs> Vibes. Union release cannon. Yeah. Love it. <laughs> Dialogue <laughs> survey cannon. Into it. Huge reporter cannon. That sounds right. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> horoscope, huge. <laughs> horoscope chin cannon. Okay, I love that. Yeah. Uh, I love that. Peace display cannon. Preparation if. That's almost like preparation at. Here, adjectives. Uh, or no, just all, I guess. Yeah, just all. And then first letter. Last letter should be... Eh, what the fuck. Let's do it. Medicine body. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good one for you, Nick. Medicine body cannon. Yeah, I like that. Handy equinox. <laughs> Wait, if I save... Okay. Base fill. Chart slippery. No definition. <laughs> no definition cannon. <laughs> Negotiation force that cannon. One, that one's the beta of the bunch. Humor no exclude definition. cannon. People saying ink inkjet. <laughs> Remedy? <laughs> <laughs> Remedy, okay, this one's interesting. This one actually he might use. Remedy homosexual canon. Like, you gotta fix the gay. He's a religious guy. So who is gay? Yeah. Mean radical canon. <laughs> Salad <laughs> bulletin canon. I'd feel that. Salad bulletin. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so there you go. Uh, Nick and the next kids, just use that, and uh, it'll save you some time. Yep. There it is. Air for a fortune. Nick Cannon. <laughs> He's repopulating the world. The Lord knows we need it. Oh, and then there's one more. Th Actually, there's two more things, and they're both really good. She's going to be happy we talked about it. So I get emotional when I talk about the next thing, but David Dobrik commissioned. Yo, is this fucking out of pocket? David Dobrik commissioned an artist to make an eye that's all gouged out and crazy. <laughs> and he says it's modeled after my actual eyeball. Is this just a little bit out of pocket, bro? <laughs> He's fucking you, stunting on Jeff with this. Dude. You've DI'd two people, <laughs> and now you're adorning your house with eyes? Yeah. You got a fucking sick. I feel like the image of an eye <laughs> should be at least a little triggering at this point, right? Uh, Shouldn't it yeah. remind you of the guilt? Or, 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 or the pleasure. The pleasure. Right. Like a serial killer has, uh, you know, Turns trinkets. The scene of the crime. Mm. <laughs> Dude, this is sick. His though. blood slides. He has an eye sculpture yeah. for every eye he takes. This is crazy. Why the eye, bro? Is yeah. it intentional, do you think? Is he trying to send a message? How could it not? Well, this artist <laughs> How could it specializes not in, in eye art. Like, that's what she does. Sure. So. If he was getting something from her, it was gonna be an eye. Right. Yeah, but just don't get something from her. Right. Exactly. Go to a different That's, artist. The thing. That's what I'm saying. It like has to be. How <laughs> could he not? He wanted an eye. I know he's like pissed at Maybe Jeff. Maybe he's like looking for an eye and he didn't get it from Jeff, so he's like he's trying collecting. to find it somewhere he's elsewhere. The eye he's a bloodborne boss. Oh, uh, Inari says, Hi, Ethan. I want to say thank you for being so open about your Tourette's and mental health. I'm 21 and have been diagnosed with Tourette's. ASD, um, what's ASD? ADHD and PTSD. If it was Autism a, spectrum disorder. Oh, okay. Man, you got the whole fucking full house. Yeah, you got a you, you got a full shit. Inari, you got dealt everything. God's like, I'll just fucking just give him everything. Give him the works. Yeah, man. Is that, I don't know if that's a male or, or woman's name, but yeah, dude, you you got it. You got it. That's crazy. You got you know what's weird? Like the Rett syndrome usually goes hand to hand with all the kind of other fucked up shit like ADHD and stuff. But um, thank you. You're gonna be great. Just get. Oh, I did get a text from Jeff. Oh, Jeff wants to call in. Yes. Oh, he hasn't seen it. He said, "What eye statue? Holy shit! You got to be kidding me." Yeah, I'm down to call in. Okay. Okay. This is great. How does he call in, Dan? Uh, here I'll send him a Zoom link, or I'll send it to you, and then you send it to him. Yeah. I'm sending. Sending it in our main chat right now. That's awesome that we broke this story. <laughs> okay, hold on. Jeff's going to call in. This is great. This is great. This is great. 
Okay, Ethan. Subreddit comment says, David collects the eyes of his friends to form one giant eye like Ethan collects the hairlines of all his enemies. <laughs> <laughs> okay, this is awesome. Thank you, Jeff. He's my bestie, by the way. Right, yeah, I've heard. Clearly, clearly. Yeah, you know, you're, you, you'll be good, man. I'm glad you're getting help, though. That's really important. Because I had, you know, my anxiety disorder, which I think is related to Tourette's in some way, and ADHD. Once you tie it all together and start treating that, everything makes it, starts to make a lot more sense. Apparently, Inari uh, is a word in, is a name in Japanese, a proper noun in Japanese, but also in Finnish, of all things. So, hmm. it's per- Probably more likely Finnish than Japanese, Could I would be. Assume, but we'd love that for you. All right, so let me know if if old Jeffy boy gets back to you. So excited to talk to Jeff. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. <laughs> uh, so you sent it to him? Yeah. All right, I am keeping an eye on the Zoom to see if he joins. Uh, yeah, no, yeah, he's so, just having a big joke out of it. <laughs> yeah, I was... Um, I was talking to Jeff, and he told me that he used to do a show with Jonah. You know Jonah; he's part of the vlog squad and everything. Jeff or David actually almost killed him too in that motorcycle stunt. But Jeff said that David's telling everybody to not. He's demanding that people don't associate with Jeff because he's toxic and shit. So Jonah literally stopped working with Jeff because of David. (laughs) Jeff's toxic. Oh yeah. Okay. Yeah, Jeff's toxic. Okay. The dude whose face got slammed into an excavator okay. by David. Okay, David. <laughs> yeah, those people are still riding with David. It's crazy. <laughs> but even even the people in the vlog squad got to know that this is a little fucking crazy. <laughs> well, they take it. They take it as a warning. It is. It, this is a straight up warning. <laughs> Don't forget what I did to the last guy who crossed me. <laughs> Can anybody uh, go to the pizza place? Oh, yeah. Anybody Dude, it was, it's like still lined up around the block. Really? It's insane. God oh, wow. It. Okay. God fucking damn it. This man's still selling pies, and he's got an eye in his house, and y'all still buying pizza from him. Dad. Listen, Jeff. You dare to talk to me? You want to sue me for slamming your face into an excavator? (laughs) Here's a picture of your other eye. It looks good in my office. Be a shame if something happened to your other eye. Eh, You can't see. Be happy for the one eye you've got, you understand me? I'll send a pie. It's compliments of Dobrik. Papa Dobrik. I'll send you a fish eye pie. Jeff just joined the lobby. Yes! That's the magic of live. Do you know what I'm saying? You can't do this pre recorded. It's you true. Can, well, yeah, I mean, totally do it live! Um, it's just not as fun, is it? <laughs> All right, uh, I just hit accept. Hopefully we are waiting. Uh, Jeff Wittick, friend of the show, to discuss the eye. Okay, Drum I roll. see his video, just waiting on him to connect to audio. David Dahmer, that's interesting. I hear him. Hey, hear friend of the show, Jeff Wittick is here. Yes, how are you? Good, good, this is Kyle, he's my soundbite guy. Hey Kyle, Hello. nice to see you again. I want to say thanks to Zach for that nice shout out he gave Kyle that one day. Hey, I love you Zach. Love you too, Kyle. Did that mean a lot to you, Kyle? Yeah. Yeah, it did. Yeah, I see that. He's yeah. a, Zach's a big deal in the industry. <laughs> he is. Yeah. Hey, sound biting is a rare art that it, it takes is. time to get good at. It, it really is, you know. It used to be a real discipline back during the radio day, but it's a forgotten art. It's a lost art, and Zach is, um, what would you say, you're, you're, you're relighting the flame. Uh, is that right, Zach? Um, I'm trying my best to do that, yeah. yeah. But I appreciate the compliment, guys. Thank you very much. You're crushing it over there. I'm a big fan of the show. We are over here at Jeff FM. <laughs> yeah, Jeff FM. Uh, Jeff FM. So, uh, Jeff FM. That's funny to say. Jeff FM. There's you a lot hadn't. Of Fs. You hadn't many. seen the um, the eyeball. I was, you hadn't seen that till I sent it to you. I mean, Ethan. For me to live a healthy life, I can't 
watch what this fucking psychopath does all day long. But thank you for yeah. sending it to me and sending me on a tear all day. Oh, no. Because now my blood is boiling. So no, I'm just messing around. I don't get too emotional about it. But what are your thoughts? What do you, do you want me to say? No, I'm curious. What what I, I guess what I'm to- curious is, do you think he's doing this intentionally or is he oblivious? I mean, me and my fucking mind. Yeah, I think he does. Because. Do it. Uh, intentionally, yeah, I think he's a fucking nut job, and ob- it's obvious, you know. Or actually, you know what? Maybe he doesn't. Maybe he's that delusional where he just doesn't think. So I, I, I don't know. I'm gonna. Wi- I agree. It has to be intentional because I mean, the eyeball thing is like, it's way too fucking obvious, right? Like, how could you for not realize? And you're not even the first person whose eye he fucked up. He, he yeah, blinded his friend. Say, maybe it's the other guy's eye popped out. Yeah. So, that's pretty crazy, dude. I don't know, man. Let me pull over so we can dive deeper into this. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. I don't want you to... I was watching earlier. I saw you guys are, are dropping those cards. The H3 cards. Those oh, you dope. like them? You want a pack? Mm-hmm. Yeah, they're cool. Yeah, please. Some. I'll put you in touch with the guy if you want to make some cards with them. He's a good dude. Please. Yeah, Jeff, so, I'll hook um, you up. Hey, that's him right I'm now, Hi. Max. Yeah. I'm the guy who made them. Yeah. <laughs> oh, nice to meet you, Max. Max is here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, uh, yeah, oh we, could, we could put you in touch. Yeah, so, yeah, I just saw this and I was like, damn, I wonder what Jeff thinks. If this is intentional or if he's just like so fucking unbothered by it. I don't know. It seems intentional to me. Probably unbothered. To be honest, you know, I mean, it's it's a pretty stupid thing to do. He's either trying to piss me off or he just doesn't give a fuck, you know, which he hasn't given a fuck. And that's what the whole thing that pissed me off about was, you know. Yeah. And he I mean, he is actively, though, like thinking about you because hasn't he told like all the other vlog squad guys not to associate with you at all? Yeah, that's true. You know, I'm sure he's it's it's crossed his mind, but. I try not to think about what he's up to, you know. Hey Jeff, I just cut all I just cut the double hair a uh, mohawk off. What do you think about my new do? I can't believe you kept it for that long. Da, I know. Honestly. I thought you'd be impressed by that. I had it on for almost like three fucking weeks, dude, at least. Yeah, but this girl killed it. I actually went and followed her in, on Instagram. No beef. No no hairdresser beef. She's talented. <laughs> she's awesome. Yeah, she's really cool. It looks great. Thanks, man. Thank you. I had a fun hair journey with you. It was a good time. So what can we uh, do in retaliation? What can we do to Jeff? To Or what can we do to David, like a sculpture that we can make to piss him off? Oh, that's a good question. Because I'm down. Uh, if you, if, I'm down to do something. If you, but you know what I mean? Like, what's... Uh, oh, well, somebody... You heard about somebody uh, spray-painted rapist on his... On his... Um, pizza place oh yeah, yeah i saw keemstar I had a funny joke there yeah he came that, yeah he did good i hate to say it but yeah the streets don't forget <laughs> you know i just wish you know that that they put like an eyeball on there or something you know that'd be nice uh, that, maybe we just do an eyeball statue ourselves our own reclaim the eyeball for ourselves didn't he throw like a pine cone at his friend's eye and blind him? Maybe we get like a pine cone eyeball excavator thing. Oh, that you might not want to see that though, too. No, I don't mind the excavator. That doesn't bother me. So maybe but we could eyeball. Have... <laughs> By the way, take it back. What do you think about this? Uh, rumor has it this is going to be his Halloween costume next year. Can you see this? Can you see? Oh, oh my god. Yeah, yeah. So this is out of this is way inappropriate. This is not cool at all. <laughs> I, you know, Ethan, I don't know what you want me to say about it. Yeah, it fucking pisses me off. Um, we could go on and on about it. You know, I was having a nice day. I was out on a nice ride. All right, yeah, yeah, yeah. Are you texting? And I'm like, what the fuck did he do now, you know? But I'm happy you brought it to my attention because it just goes to prove how delusional he is, you know? It's insane. It's insane. I mean, it was on our subreddit with a lot of points. By the way, Ela just messaged us. She She's donated $10 and said, hey, Jeff. Thank you, Hila. Hila just donated ten dollars to me and said, "Hey, Jeff." <laughs> oh wow, that's nice. Hi, Hila. <laughs> um, cool. Yeah, let's think. think we uh, should. Yeah, go ahead. Well, I mean, what do, what do I want here? I want. I, I would like that statue. 
that'd be nice for them to send me that statue, you know? Mm. Oh. Yeah, if you win but the lawsuit, you could ask for it as part of the settlement. Put that in there, huh? <laughs> yeah. um, you could, for sure. An eye for an eye. Maybe we can make an eye for an eye thing. Yeah. Maybe we can make, we should try to commission the same girl to make some crazy ass David Dobrik style eye from an excavator and a pine cone or some shit. You think that was her idea, the artist? Because you can't know David and, and not know, like, I guess maybe some people do, but for an artist, you have to look into somebody's life. And is that like a sick fucking well, thing that they would do? In her, you know? de her defense, she specializes in making eye art. She like only makes eye art. Yeah. It's, which means David oh, so pursued the eye art girl. Oh, so they reached out to the eye art girl. Yeah, that's, that's which, actually sick. <laughs> yeah, that, exactly. That's fucking insane. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, bro. I'm sorry. I just wanted to get your thoughts, but I got you all fired up now. But let's think of something. We'll My get them. My thoughts. I'm, I'm, I'm furious. Thank you, Ethan. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> enjoy. Sound en bite. Thank you, Ethan. Yeah, enjoy At the rest of your day. One. Put this one as uh, first time ever Jeff Wittick calls into frenemies. <laughs> first and only time. Yeah, let's. Try, you know what? Uh, exactly. Let's do that. Let's wipe the, the the slate clean. What a great first call. What a great first call we had from Jeff. First time yeah, ever. Yeah. Nice Thanks to hear from you. Me. So, we love you, know, you we Jeff. We can make this a recurring thing where you guys just call me and just bring up some stuff that'll piss me off throughout the day. That yeah, I'll keep it. <laughs> yeah, I'll keep it coming, man. I'll think of you next time I see. I see something I or excavator related, and I'll just get your thoughts on it. All right. I appreciate it. Ethan, you're my eyes and ears on the street. Yeah, absolutely. Well, love the show. Love you guys. All right, Jeff. Take care. Thanks, Thanks for calling. We love see you, too. Jeff. Friend of the show. Great friend of the show. Jeff Wittick. Uh, family. Family, for family, sure. Baby. Always. Family. Just make sure Cody gets the memo on that, okay? Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> I got you. All right, guys. I'll talk to you later. Bye, Jeff. Thanks for calling. Jeff Wittick, ladies and gentlemen. What a guy. Sweet man. <laughs> didn't deserve it. Just didn't deserve what David did to him, did he? Can you pull up this artist? Uh, I'm just curious what our other art looks like. Like how... Yeah, it's in the doc. Maybe not. No, I'm not... Listen, and I'm yeah. not, uh, listen the artist is great. I'm not... Nothing against the artist. I just want to see yeah, it's not. how far... Uh, David went into commissioning her. Oh yeah, I mean it's all, it's all eyes all Dude, the time. First of all, just to be clear, I'm not. I think the artist is great. She didn't do anything wrong. She just makes cool eye shit. That's awesome. Yeah, it's actually all pretty, pretty cool. It's yeah, she's beautiful. Super... Oh, that's she's cool. actually very talented. Yeah. What's her name? Rice. And her jewelry too is really that's nice. That's really cool. But so, but like, what I was looking for <laughs> is that. Okay, so she does make these kind of sculptures, but David got the bloody eye gouged one. And I don't see a lot of those. He's like, I want the most realistic eye popping out of the head shit you got. Because, <laughs> yeah, I don't see much of it. The only other one I see is this one. But the one he had was, like, bloody, right? Mm -hmm. It was blue and pink. but yeah. The red, it, the pink red, it looks like blood you know what i'm saying there she is the eye lady well we love her and we hate david that's the vibe we might be reaching out soon for a commission so. yeah we might be commissioning our own eye. <laughs> we want a piece called an eye for an eye there it is jeff Wittick, ladies and gentlemen um uh there is one more thing that fucking pisses me off you guys heard that we were trying to get Yilan Ma to call into the show. And he big-timed us. Big time. Well, we, we offered him a thousand yuan, which is like 300 bucks. And he told us basically to go fuck ourselves. Mm -hmm. He said, don't waste my time, yep. basically. Okay. Well, Money. dude Money. perfect is out here. They and they got Elon Ma like two days after our us talking about it. Mm -hmm. Definitely stole the idea from us, by the way. Oh, it wouldn't be the first time Dude Perfect stole an idea from me. Oh, or, absolutely. or do you think that Dude Perfect gave them an offer, and they're like, okay, they paid us this. Why would we do this for 
a thousand you want. If they got to him first, Zach might be right. They might have set the bar too high. They, I think that's my. Yeah, you know. By the way, Dude Perfect's been ripping me off for a while. You know that idea they have to like do trick shots and shit. Yeah, you started. I've that. been doing that since I was like fucking eight. Wow. What's your sickest trick shot that you've ever pulled off? Dude. Uh, I could flip a red cup. Just flip it? Yeah, flip it up, and then it lands on the bottom. So it, like, starts upside down, and then you flip it, and then it's right side up? You, sometimes. I can hit that sometimes. <laughs> dude. Like, 25%. Oh, dude, yeah. that's so they rip. Sick. I'm telling you, those guys are idea thieves that fucking piss me off. You ever, yeah, um, dude. You ever, in your travels of trick shotting, you ever take, like, you know, like a 20-ounce bottle of soda, and you take it off the, the lid, and then you kind of, like, pinch it, and it, like, and it, like, shoots? You ever just, like... Do that, your friend. The fuck you talk? Oh, you mean when you get the bottle cap and yeah, do like and that? Yeah, like, yeah, and it like, and then you like do it at your friend's head, and they like, dude, why'd you do that? Yeah, dude. You ever, you ever yes, that? I have, Dan. It's sick, dude. It That's is fucking sick. sick dude. It is. Thank you for bringing that up. It is sick. So, dude, perfect got to Yilan, and I don't, I don't have dude, perfect money. These guys are like insanely popular. I, what money. do you think they paid him? Thousand bucks? I say ten grand. Yeah, I think no, they gave. 10 grand. I, I think, think they gave grand. him equity in in the in the <laughs> mega complex. I think uh, he owns ten percent now. Zach, you're not serious. You think they gave him ten grand? I think they said fuck it. I mean, it's an exclusive. Bro, there's no shot. Anyway, here's the video. He just made a TikTok for them. It's not even like that big. Iluma, uh, do perfect. Do perfect. Uh, add the Twitter space. Uh, connect with me. Uh, do perfect hair mind said him to space because <laughs> I love you. That ain't worth 10 grand. That ain't worth $300. I'll be honest. That was it? That's it. That? I didn't know what the fuck he's talking about. <laughs> was that supposed to be promotional? <laughs> I'd love uh, to find out. Like, okay. Maybe, hey, hey, uh, message him, Zach, and ask how much to do perfect I, pay. We'll match it. I just sent you that in Discord. I'm gonna, so I'm gonna we're going to find out how much yeah. do perfect okay. pay. I actually, right. I actually have some interesting intel. There's a fan uh, or a viewer of ours that messaged Iloma uh, and started talking to him. And for $1,000, he said he would do it. And he speaks Mandarin and everything. I put, I, I'll put Zach in contact with him. I think he, he can set it up for us. I'm not paying him a thousand bucks. Fuck that. No, that's but we, insane. We, we can like, that's, uh, he will do it for a thousand bucks. Maybe we can get him down. Yeah, I bet there. he would. Either way, <laughs> no way we're getting down. I'm not there's paying no his ass a thousand dollars for this shit. What do you want, what do you have want a, to say? How much did Dude Perfect a, pay you? We will pay it? Yeah, say we'll match it. Okay. We'll match it. Well, you're just going to have to take his word for it. That's fine. Like I'm just curious what it's like. $40,000. Yeah, I'd, be, I'd love to hear him say that. <laughs> you know it's not true. Million yuan. You're kidding? Yeah, you didn't hear back. Hmm? You're just... Yeah, never mind. Dude, perfect. So there it is. I'm going to go watch this again because I'm trying to understand what's the objective here. Money! Money! I'm Elon Musk. Dude, perfect. Uh, add Twitter. Space. Do perfect with uh, your Twitter space. Connect with me. They connect uh, it on there. Do perfect. <laughs> share mundo. Don't know. What is that? What is that? He said share mundo. Money. Share mundo. Money. What is that? What do you say here? <laughs> uh, do perfect. Share mundo. Uh, what the fuck is that? Share mun mundo. Send him. Send him. Space. Space. Ex By the way, he turned the experience into like 10 syllables. It's really interesting. Never heard that. I love you. Bro, I don't, it's what I'm saying. I, you know what I mean? I don't know what the fuck he, they're even trying to promote. Look, all he, just him saying dude perfect is enough. <laughs> you know, if he says H H three, yeah, that's yeah. that's amazing. I, I I don't know that it's worth. I don't know that it's Money. worth four hundred. Let's see, four hundred USD to yuan. That's what I. I was three thousand. Isn't that what I offered him? Mm, I think it was two thousand. Mm, let me double check. 
All right. Well, let's see what Dude Perfect paid. I'm dying to find so, out. So we, the our last offer was 2,000 yuan. Okay, okay. That's $300. <laughs> But what what about Twitter space? Like, are they doing a Twitter space with him? But he said they're doing a Twitter space, and then somebody's going to space, it sounded like. Well, the Do Perfect, uh, one of the dudes from Do Perfect went to space. Okay. They, like, paid for, I think it was the Bezos, like, trip or whatever. It's like 300000 or something. Uh, yeah, something like that. I'm not sure. Is that a video on the on yeah. show? That's yeah, I saw cool. it the other day. It was pretty cool. Nice. He didn't do any trick shots while he was up there, though, so. <laughs> Idiot loser ass. What the fuck? He didn't do trick shots in space? That would have been the best video. I just, I just scrubbed through it. Maybe he did, actually. Wait, but know. they probably would have to get the whole thing, because I think there's like eight seats, and so if you wanted the whole thing, it'd be like two million bucks, probably. Uh, right, yeah, there were other people in there that like oh, weren't part of the, the Dude goodness. Perfect movie. I wouldn't want to be filmed for a Dude Perfect movie if I was, you know what I mean? Oh, Wait, Jesus. I, th hmm, I think this might be a, f this is not actually a Dude Perfect, because... Moon Dao, the thing he said, it's like a cryptocurrency. <laughs> See, I was wondering if it had something to do with crypto because DAO. Yeah, like the, exactly. But That's on why, the caption, it was all one word, so that was throwing me. They even showed the channel, Dude Perfect. But I think you're yes. right. Why would Dude Perfect pay Yilong yeah. Mao? Like, it's a scam. That's Some not something that they're acting like. Is he promoting yeah. a scam? I think yeah. so because <laughs> why the f Dude Perfect is not interested in all this kind of weird. Internet subculture. Shit. Wait, somebody says he's shilling Moon Dao yeah. crypto with Dude Perfect. Is Dude Perfect part of this Moon Dao thing? What? Dude's going to the moon, this is Dude this Perfect Moon Dao. <laughs> this is so weird, dude. They paid him in crypto. There you go. I'll dude match. Perfect goes to space with crypto project Moon Dao. Okay. Oh. Wait, Dude Perfect did a crypto collab to go to space. God damn it, dude. I, These people are such fucking yeah. shells. Million shares I mean, it was one week move. ago, so it's timely. It would make sense. That makes sense, but I'm still not sure how this helps them. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> I'm still not figuring it out. I guess they These sponsored the trip. Here. Yeah. So, official what is official Moon Dow? It's just some crypto project. The first Dow to go to space. Uh, shut the fuck up. The Internet Space Program? Ugh, I'm this is so look, stupid. There, there's the post is on there, so. Time to invest. So how much did they pay him? I get they got that crazy crypto money. This is so dumb. I'm actually gonna shit and piss. It's so dumb. I just want to shit out. and piss. It's so dumb. <laughs> it's so dumb. Like what? What we did? It's crypto, Elon Ma, dude, perfect in space. It's so fucking dumb. It's all dumb. Meanwhile, FTX is crap is going bankrupt because again the owners like doing fraud. And crypto is like again basically down to fuck all and like they're still shelling crypto. Who the fuck is doing this? That's not fraud. Small note, their post with Elon uh has sixty three retweets and only hundred and eight likes. That's what I'm saying. Why would they pay Elon Ma his ten billion yuan fee? Well, you have your answer. They're paying him in this token. You didn't even get that. Got them in on the ground floor. Of Early moon investor, Dio. Elon Ma, dude. Like, the, how, who wouldn't want to be? Dude, you want to know how this baby. thing's a scam? You want to know how this thing's a scam? Go back to their Twitter profile. It's literally. It says we're going to the moon. Literally, it's their whole thing is we're going to the moon. Scamming people. That's fucking literally dog whistle scam shit. We're going to the moon literally. This thing will be at zero in two months. Hey, moon's going <laughs> to the moon, baby. <laughs> That's crazy. Why do perfect working with them? Like you guys have enough legit sponsors. It's just send them to the fucking space. I mean, that is. I guess. I would play this yeah, video, there's... but every time I try and uh, fast forward it, Twitter's uh oh. We're gonna... Oh, it's got music. Yeah, I don't just I don't want to oh, get. Oh look, he did do a trick shot. Okay, yeah, I he just it all let back. go of a ping pong ball. It'd be funny if they just had a horrible crash to Earth. That's a hell of a trick shot. It's like, oh, you're so good at trick shots, and why'd you crash on Earth? <laughs> They should have trick shotted the pod into like a giant fucking. <laughs> That's why they're building the building. It's it's the land. Like you yeah. know how that building's all crazy shaped. Yes. It's gonna like land in a funnel and then. Yes. You want to impress me? Do perfect fucking trick shot yourself into a volcano. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, dude. <laughs>
<laughs> then I'll be impressed. Until then, leave Elon Musk alone. He's mine. Fucking up the whole market. <laughs> All right, let's talk about my my uh, car getting stolen now at long last. Oh, and then we can do the uh, egg drop, which I'm, we're all super excited about. Okay, how where do I begin with this? Um, fuck, it's hard to talk about. Um, two hundred fifty thousand to go to space per person. Yeah, pretty. How well. many seats is in it? Look like eight or something. Yeah. Yeah, something that's a lot like of that. money. Also, it is expensive, and also, like, you're only in space. I recall for like five minutes or something. Like, it's really, really. Short. Yeah, it's a quick little. Up but I guess if trip. you have all the money in the world, it's cool. I mean, I'd do it if I had a quarter million dollars. Do you trust there? that Bezos's tech there to not blow up? Still. I mean, so far so good, right? <laughs> yeah. There's and good. also, I mean, what they're doing. Is I mean, not to downplay it too much. Obviously, it is cool, but the the quick up and down trip like that. I mean, we're talking about what the Mercury program was doing in like the early '60s. Like it, it's I don't want to say it's easy, but like as far as space stuff goes, uh, quick low Earth orbit. All you need rotation. is one loose tile, brother. I mean, it's true. It's true. <laughs> I, I, it's still risky for sure, but it's relatively safe, I would say. Yo, by the way, somebody tell Yilong Ma that Bitcoin's down 75% this <laughs> year. Oof. You doing okay, love, with the crypto? No comment. I mean, <laughs> no comment. <laughs> nah, I mean, at this point, whatever. <laughs> Fuck it. <laughs> somebody says, lol, Ethan, just say Ely drove your car and move on. <laughs> That's not what happened, actually. That's not what happened. Yeah, no, I That's got That's not fun. what happened. How... I got Dare they downplay Yeah, that. so, um... <laughs> <laughs> He's upset, guys. Don't, this isn't funny. This isn't funny, audience. No, it's not. Actually, so what happened was, you guys heard that I had got, like, the first BMW electric car. I was super excited about. I was going to get rid of my Tesla electric car. Because, well, obviously, fuck Elon Musk, but even more than that, it's just nice. Before, it was like Tesla was the only option, and now there's so much competition coming out, and I was just super excited to get this BMW SUV to replace the Tesla. We pre-ordered it a year ago. A year ago. Mm -hmm. Custom fucking made. Wow. Specked out. Put the deposit and everything. Lena has been talking to them. Lena, you want to tell them what happened? BMW. Mm -hmm. This is your c customer support? Go ahead, Lena. Yeah, uh, I'll try to be as nice as possible. Well, no, I'm not going to be mean, but the customer service was horrible. So yeah, as Ethan said, you guys have been waiting like a year now for this custom ordered BMW. And when I called last week to follow up on it, they're like, oh, we already gave it away. <laughs> they said it, it, the car arrived and there was someone there at the dealership that day who wanted it and they sold it because there was that That's one so point where insane. like you were kind of on the fence. You wanted to look at other electric Ela cars. Ela was freaking out because she's like, oh, it got a bad review. And I was like, I'll take it. I'll take it. I'll take it. You can take my car. Yeah, so we were just wondering with the dealership, we didn't cancel the order, but we were just curious if we were to back out, what would happen? Um, and I guess they just went with that and, you know, since there was a Well, no, he's there. like, you can't get your deposit back. It was $3,500. Yeah, yeah. And, well, we said, okay, okay, cool. We just left it open. And then this motherfucker, it wasn't open. We had the reservation. We paid for the fucking mm -hmm. thing. And we never canceled it. And I guess he just like refunded us without saying anything and then just pawned it off to the next person. Yeah, <laughs> so that's that's, weird. I don't know how he would go through that without even like letting us know. He refunded and didn't say anything. Did you mm -hmm. confirm that they sent the money back, Lena? I'm waiting for um, your accountant to get back to us. So this is, this is a common thing. You paid a deposit, right? 3,500 bucks. We ordered the specs and everything. That's what... I guess to put this nicely. Waited a year, dude. That's what pieces of shit car dealers can be. Yeah, it's so fucked up. But BMW, like, th and this is my first time going BMW. Okay, I've never had one of their cars, and um, this is my first experience with BMW. I gotta say, the Germans have done it. They're German, right? 
Yes. Well, the, yeah. They're German. Yeah. The yeah. Company is okay, German. as a Jewish man, I expect better from the German. <laughs> okay, okay but, but here's not the... fucking twice. This will never happen again. We said. Here, here's the thing though. When you ordered that car, you got it at MSRP. You were gonna pay MSRP. There's yes. probably some fucker that yes. came in that they're like, oh, we can charge him an extra for that new car, probably an extra twenty five. Well, grand. you know what pissed me off? They pawned our car. You're right. Do we pay SMRP for that, Lena? Probably, because we just yeah. pre-ordered online. It's like they didn't mm -hmm. even. And then they go, "Okay, but we have one that's similar." Right. Super rare, they say too. They fucking shit. liar. Yeah, it, it's like, and that's what got, really got me so mad too. Um, he his response was horrible when I was telling him what, what happened and how could he do that. He's like, "Well, it, the car is gone. You know, there's no point in arguing. We have this other car here." You know that your boss might like, and I just I couldn't believe no, it. So, so, so the other car, by the way, similar car, upcharged like thirty thousand dollars. They probably charge forty five for yours then. If the one you ordered was better, they're like, no, no, no. This one's marked. Up. It's a, it's a similar car. It's just marked up twenty five thousand dollars. Motherfucker! I said, hell no, bro. Fuck that. Where's the where's the BMW CEO? Who can I talk to? They, that's how it is right now. That's, it's fucked. But how can you do that? I pre order What's the point of a pre-order? It doesn't I matter. I pre-order the car. I put the money. I got this shit that I like. So what, what the, the process doesn't work. It, you order more cars then. It, it doesn't. It, it That's how dealers are. They're always looking to find that quicker, higher buck. BMW. Yeah. Shame on you. It doesn't matter. We haven't forgotten BMW. We haven't forgotten what you did. <laughs> I'll never forget. Yo, never again, we said. We said never again. Is that really BMW? Everyone. During World War II, BMW made uh, planes for the Nazis and stuff. <laughs> I mean, all German companies did, obviously. So. There's a bit of Hitler in everyone. <laughs> <laughs> never again. I swear to God. I try to give you guys a chance, and this is my experience. My own car taken away from me, like the luggage of passengers off trains in 1942. <laughs> It's outrageous. It's unforgivable. Never again. <laughs> it's a shame. I was excited for you guys to get that car because I personally am a fan of BMWs. I wanted to try At least the it. ones made after 1945. <laughs> <laughs> but what kind of fucking... This is like insane. Like how can I in good faith go back and get a car after that? Because they were like so rude and mean to Lena too. They're like, well, it's gone. So what do you want to do? About I couldn't it? believe it. So I can attest to this because she was on speakerphone talking to the dealership and I, I she was outside. I stepped out and was hearing some of it, and I couldn't believe how much of a dick the guy was being. You can hear him talking. Yeah. And also, uh, Lena was fired up. I've never seen Lena fired yeah, up Lena's like that. Yeah, Lena's epic. a warrior. I knew she'd go to bat for us, but... <laughs> yep. It was both the sales rep and the sales manager. They so teamed up on you? Not not the same time, but, you know, once the, the rep wasn't doing anything, and then I spoke to his manager, and he was even worse. They cut her off mid sentence and like laughed about it. They're like, "Why are we still talking about it? the car's gone? Like, yeah, why are we like, talking about it?" What do you want it? me yeah. to do for you? That's what it. The fuck? I was like, the Amazing. I was like, "That motherfucker said that." <laughs> that's so fucked up, dude. Like, okay, well, that's never happened to me at other brands. I mean, it's just not. It's just not happened. It's not happened to me at Tesla. That's for sure. I guess I'll be working with them again, BMW. Fuck you. <laughs> well, Tesla differs in like you. You order a car, and it, it's not really like they have a. Dealership. There's no heckling, right? Which is cool. That's the one That's thing actually, the motherfuckers yeah. got right. I love that. I By the way, ha disagree. happy a. Thank you for the five gifted. Thank you for the gifted. Thank you for the gifted. Yeah. So I don't know, man, and and you know. I thought it was free speech. People are saying name the dealership. No. Nah. nah. Don't do that. Nice try, chat. Mm, you guys really wanted me to forget, ruin my life over here. BMW once assured my dad. Did not speak English. Assumed. Not Assumed my dad did not speak English and suggested he would be more comfortable at a Ford dealers? <laughs> what? It's pretty fucked up. He's like, yeah, listen. <laughs> we don't take, we don't deal with, uh... Listen, you don't speak English, I'm gonna assume you're poor. I'm assuming that's the subtext. All right. Go to Ford. I don't like BMWs, personally. I gotta say. I fucking hate BMWs, you know. <laughs> yeah. I mean, it's the dealership, obviously. Yeah. It, not... Yeah, right, but the it's their cars. Itself. They're they're the ones that are letting this happen. Well, if you run it up the chain, like if you want to go, what chain? Call corporate BMW corporate. Did you call on corporate, Lena? No, I haven't. Let's get the fucking. I swear to God. Bro. Oh yeah, no, they won't. They won't be happy about that. Mm -hmm. I'll I'll go to Germany right now. <laughs> it's a you, short flight, Lena. You can tell corporate the dealership. 
I'm not going to say it on stream to 40,000 people. Love, can I go with you? I'd really like to go. As much as I'd love to, because those are dead. Sure. It's not worth it. You never know. They might not do anything. Uh, Yeah, I didn't think about Uh, pursuing it further. Just because, you know, no one else has been able to help. Then you're going you're gonna to get a hold of the president. He'd be like, look, the car's gone. What do you want me to do? <laughs> it says the same thing. <laughs> Saying it in German. Hold on. Let me, let's, hold on. Let me, let me plug you into the board of directors. Listen, the car's gone. What do you want us to do, lady? They're not Ten people. <laughs> Honestly, if you do call them, as much as I'd love to see this, they're not going to do anything. They're going to think nothing's wrong. Zach is black-pilled as shit. Because I've been through this this ring around for fucking years. Like, it's just bullshit. Well, I'm, the thing that's really crazy is that our lease on the Tesla is up in, like, a week. And we specifically timed this so that we would get this car mm-hmm, right. and return that one. And then they, they fucking... They, not only did they sell our car to someone else, they didn't even tell us. They didn't say anything. They just returned the money, apparently, I haven't even confirmed it's in our right. bank account, without saying a fucking thing. After telling Lena the 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 uh, deposit is non-refundable. Yeah, that's just that's how they are, man. And it's Fuck unfortunate. It's shitty. It's really you, shitty. You, dude. Fuck you. And I feel the car market needs to start turning into more like a Tesla thing. Like, I think that is a great fucking idea in how we buy cars. But... You mean buying them like literally every other product that you buy? Pretty much, yeah. <laughs> Instead no of for some reason doing this like, one whole fucking dance. price. That's why the Carvana thing is so cool that people are really into. You literally go to like yeah, that or thing CarMax is, does that too. Dude, or, they have the big towers like a mm-hmm. gumball machine. You put a coin in. <laughs> Wait, what? Yeah, what are you referring to? Like yeah, when you, when you about. Car, car yeah, and it and it comes down in the elevator. Oh, 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 it's gotcha. Like a big ass fucking tower with cars in it. Gotcha. Yeah. When yeah. you pay when you pay for it, they give you a big ass token. Yeah. No, I agree. I, I hate that cars, it's just culturally you have to do this. Is this the case in other countries? Like, love, when you go, have you ever bought a new car? Or do you know? <laughs> I, I, I know you always drive junkers. $1,000. I know, I get it. But, but do you know, like in Sweden, is there this whole like... Uh, dance like haggling dance that you do when you go and buy a car or is you just you pay I what they ask for I mean it's very I don't know honestly I don't know I don't buy new cars ever okay maybe somebody in the chat knows if like in Europe if they have the same we have dealerships but not uh, I don't think many people buy new cars here <laughs> to be honest huh. they're always old <laughs> um yeah, I don't know. So I'm kind of fucked now. I don't know what even to do. It's like super pissed off. It's just so fucked up. Yeah, I don't know if it's a... It seems like a breach of contract. I mean... Well, did you sign a contract with them? We must have signed something, uh, right? I don't know. I feel like... Yeah, they're... I they're, sent the money. Except uh, that's the thing, too. There was no, like, cancellation form that was signed, though. Just the that refund receipt that they showed me. Which also, that form wasn't signed either, so... Yeah, of course it wasn't signed. We didn't even know it happened. Stupid, bro. It's just a common case of someone they wanted more money at that time and they weren't willing to wait. And it's shitty. It's really shitty. Yeah, well, they fucked me. So BMW, I'll. I said never forget. I give you another chance, and here we are. You know, it's just not right, man. It's just not right. Just line me up in a in a fucking line and make me dig my own grave while you're at it. Fuck. The car is trash anyways, don't worry. <laughs> it's like... <laughs> you know. Trash. Why maybe you, just, maybe uh, you should get a Volvo. <laughs> Go with a nice Ooh, Swedish car. Or a Polestar. <laughs> <laughs> Volvo Swedish? Yeah. Yeah. Oh. I prefer to drive a Volvo. <laughs> yo! Shit. Yo! 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 Sorry, sorry, sorry. Sorry. You know what I mean? Just put, just why don't you sentence me to five years of hard labor while you're at it, or three or four? I don't know what it was. Bitch. Fucking hell, bro. Swear to God. Just when you thought the Nazi party was over. We take your car, Ethan. <laughs> <laughs> we see your last name is, is, is the uh, Klein. Ooh. The Jew. We said his. Well, Klein car. is a German last name. That might have thrown him off a little that's bit. True. Maybe that's why they originally were going to sell it, but then they did some digging and they it were is like, a wait German a minute. Last name. Fuck. It's true. Probably don't mind fucking over other Germans. God damn it. So, oh, and about the car crash, yeah, I bumped my, uh, 
I bumped my car into a curb. So. <laughs> it was devastating. Yeah, no, it's a little scratch on the rim. It's fine, though. Oh, no, stolen. I mean, no, I, sorry, that's not what I meant. I meant uh, stolen, which means, uh, well, it was stolen. Yeah, it makes sense. You had a car stolen from you. Yeah, the BMW fucking dealership stole it. Sons of bitches, fuckers. What can we, we, should we go up the chain, Lena? Let's cause, let's t kick up some dust, dude. What rules? I'm in for sons whatever. Of bitches. What rules? <laughs> maybe, maybe you could tweet at, oh. <laughs> oh, shit. Sorry. You know what, that, you know what, it's okay, because that doesn't work. Marriott still left me on red, so, in my situation. Fuck Marriott, dude. dude. Yeah. And fuck we talked about Marriott. it on the show, and they still were like, fuck this, we don't give a shit. They probably promoted that, dude. <laughs> for real. Good job. Dude, I'm about to content. Keep the ruffians out. Content court their ass. <laughs> God damn. Yeah, so that's it. I don't know. I'm never getting a BMW. Bummer. Yeah. This is the CEO. Is this him? C CEO of North America. It's kind of bold. CEO. All right, brother. I'm calling you out. Looks like he shaved his tiny mustache. Though. You fucked me for the last time. <laughs> don't make me draw a mustache right here. Yeah, and show your true colors. Heil Hitler. Kind of looks like the or or a CEO <laughs> guy. What did Dan just say? That Heil me. Hitler. That's Dan. What the I, fuck? That's a soundbite. Seriously? Out of context. Aren't you half Jewish? Yep. Sure am. I would never. <laughs> I'm calling you out, President of North America. I demand reparations. You stole my car, damn it. Don't you know what you done to my people? I ain't no way I'm going through that again. Is this, no. is this Jewish cowboy? Yeah, what, I, we're getting lost in the <laughs> I don't know how to do the Jewish stuff. And hey, it was such a shanda. You just talk like you were talking. God, dude, where's, his head, where's, where's their headquarters based? What city? I'm not asking for their address. <laughs> it's public information. BMW? What city they're located in. Yeah. I'm going to guess they're in Berlin. No, no, no. In North America. Oh, I, they probably are in the south. Let's see. So that's what I was doing. North American headquarters BMW is in New Jersey. New Jersey, I tell you what, mate, back in the South, I'm coming to New Jersey, and I'm be, I'm picking in, I'm be doing protests, never again. Never again, we said, oh, we, I'm getting all my brothers and sisters, we gonna have a do -si do out there, boy. A do -si do for freedom. Shalom on the range. Shalom on the range, <laughs> motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm so pissed, bro. Fuck, fuck BMW. I'm never going BMW. <sighs> I'm sorry, dude. That, that's shitty. I just got, what am I going to do? I have a week to find a car now. Go to a, f a fucking Audi, man. Superior car. <laughs> Audi. I want an electric car. They have them. Audi mm, has a full electric car? E-tron. Check it out. They're Germans, too, though. It's true. Well, they company. make the most en high engineered car. I mean, no, really Audi has a full electric car. Yeah, the e-tron. It's an e it's an SUV. It's the same size as the. Are you uh, serious? Yeah, it's pretty cool actually. It's a great fucking. Wait, car. what? E-tron SUV. It looks just like the Model Y. At least the back does. Do they have one on the dealership, uh, Lena? It's probably going to be another like year out. No, those are easier to get than the Beamers because the, the Audis have been out for a minute. Oh, okay. Well, the thing is, we called. Well, he's like, "Yo, we have another one we can sell you." So it's like it's not that fucking rare. It's just it's going to cost you twenty five thousand dollars more. And on principle, I'm not doing it. Yeah. yeah. Fuck them. Yeah, that's bullshit. You know, fuck them. This is fully electric. Yeah, the Etron. Hmm. Etron. Etron. Electric SUV. Is golden gloves to Tesla's MMA? What the fuck does that mean? It's a weird analogy. It's a real SUV. I'm sorry, Dave. Yes, sir. I'm afraid I can't do that. <laughs> Should we call them, Lena? Should we see if anyone has one of these in a, in town? Yeah, we could. And we can just say tell BMW to suck a fat donut. Between the two, the BMW does look nicer. Yeah, I, oh, I do, really? I do I gotta say so. that. I was pretty excited about it, I'll just be real. Sorry, I Zach. Suck a fat <laughs> donut, okay. All right. Preference. But you gotta go beamer. with the He's a Beamer hater. But You're I don't know, they got, I don't hate Beamer. I just feel so burned, you know? I thought you don't like Beamers. I do like Beamers, but Audi's a superior car. Okay. We could just go through a different dealer, and then that way you'll get your BMW. Right. 
yeah, just don't reward them. But I just want, yeah, okay. Thank you. We'll figure it out. But that's how, that is the clickbait. Got you guys. Fucking got ya. Ethan's car was stolen. That was a good one. That was AB's idea. So round of applause to AB for that one. Thank you. Thank you. I'm learning. Yeah, it was a good one. Really good one. <laughs> Mr. Beast passed PewDiePie in sub count, apparently. That's pretty incredible. That was fast. You know who he didn't pass, though? My boy's a T-Series. Let's go. T-Series oh, fucking that? rules, dude. Wait, how many subs are they at? I don't know. They might Thank not you, even. Thank you, Tori, who says Kia EV6. What, Kia has a fully electric car, too? T-Series is 229 million. It's not even fucking Whoa. close, bro. They're do they literally did a lap around PewDiePie. Yeah, they lapped his ass. Dude. T-Series is goaded, dude. That's uh, insane. Yeah, I mean, they post like a hundred times a day. The views they get are nuts. And it's not fair. India has more people. More, bigger pool to draw from. Although PewDiePie is international. Okay, let's yeah. move on. Let's move on. So is Mr. Beast. Okay, I'm super excited now. We're moving on to the main segment. It's going to be so much fun. You guys are going to want to watch this. It's the egg drop competition. We have five teams of two. Here's how the game works. First of all, what are the teams? It's, I know it's me and Dan. Yes, and then uh, AB and Lena. Yeah. Ian and Sam. Yeah. Zach and Cam. Mm -hmm. Yep. And then Olivia and Love, which that's going to be interesting. Love, you're just going to have to be yelling at Olivia uh, what you want her to do remotely. <laughs> so. That is interesting. I, tr that is I trust Olivia, though. She's. Yeah, okay. I think, I think you guys will spot mine someday. Thank you. Okay. So the rules are this we're going to draw a number out of a hat one through five. One goes first, five goes last. You can pick three items from the table. Only three, not including tape. To make the most cushioned egg drop uh, pod you can. When the team is done, we are going to the top of that, what, 15 foot? Uh, how many, how, how tall we got there? And we are gonna drop it and see does that egg survive? And maybe we can even have a tournament where the winners go on to a round two. I'm wondering, though, because when William does it, he drops it off like a two-story building. I'm wondering if that's not high enough, if they'll, like, all not break. But we'll see. I don't know if it will. It, maybe we need to throw it up in the air at this... Throw it up. Yeah, that would be good. Although the dropping, it's gonna be messy. you drop it, and then you can control where the impact is. That's the whole point of that. Well, let's take that element away. <laughs> All right. Oh, so it's a 360. It has to be a 360. All right, so let's pull, let's pull uh, the first contestants there. Okay. From the hat, Sam. I'm, I'm going to, well, I have numbers in here, so it's going to go by. So me, me and Dan will go first. Come on, Dan. Dan is drawing. Give me that number one. Two. Okay, I like two. I like two. Okay. Um, Why don't you draw for two. Me and Dan are number two. Loving that. I'm going to draw for Ian and I. The sooner you go, you're at a huge advantage for rest in peace. Because as the items get picked, there'll be less great items there. I'm going to go for me and Cam. Cameron and Zach are choosing. I believe in you, Zach. Get us number one. Five. My no, man. I don't Five. Believe you. Ouch. Brutal. Looks like Sam's, or it looks like Zach's going to be using the maxi pads. All right. <laughs> that was my, the, my, <laughs> my focus. <laughs> number one. Three. Three. So I think Four. that leaves. Four. That's just one number, right? So there yeah. you go. All right. So A, B, and Lena are stepping up as our first contestants. Let's get up to the activities table here so you guys have three minutes or what is it yeah th or no how long two minutes two minutes and three items so hold on hold on turn around don't look at the items no strategizing ahead of time where we come on we got to keep all right so um dan how are you doing back there you're getting the camera ready okay how are you guys feeling you're feeling confident oh yeah yeah, yeah. very i mean the first place is a coveted spot you guys are in really good shape there yeah. Yeah. Oh, I can't look. Okay. We can't look. Yeah, we're yeah. feeling good. 
confident. Feeling, feeling you guys talked about this beforehand? No, no, he just asked me right now, do you know what we're doing? And I said yes. <laughs> okay, good, yeah, yeah. All right, so we are waiting for Dan to um, prep the camera there. Dan is prepping the camera. How you guys doing? Any weird uh, shenanigans at your apartment re recently? Uh, no, we had a squatter next door, which was weird because usually our apartments haven't had any problems like mm -hmm. that. That was interesting. Um, besides that, nothing really. How'd you know there was a squatter there? I heard like some thumping next door and I have never seen a neighbor mm. in my apartment, like ever, like any neighbors ever. It's kind of weird. Mm. And I went outside and there's like three cops uh, with one of the neighbor ladies who said she heard the shower turn on mm. and somehow alerted. But how do you get the cops out for that? That seems kind of. Oh, where we, where we live? I mean, I don't know. They don't, cops don't mess around there. Mm -hmm. Really? Yeah, what? I've, I haven't seen one homeless person there. I've, I've heard that the cops, I don't know if it's true, but I heard that cops pick up the homeless by where we live and drop them off downtown. Yes. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. Dan agrees. Really? Yes, but that's it true. Was, that's crazy. Uh, Dan and Olivia agree, yeah. Yeah. Just okay, really so, okay guys, so, do you have a timer back there, uh, Ian, or I can do it on my phone? I guess for this one, you'll have to, because the... All right, let me get my timer open. So, um, as I start the, the timer, guys, you have two minutes. You will begin your selection. And uh, building. Okay, you have two minutes. Are you guys ready? Yeah. Okay. Okay. And go. Two minutes. All right, Lena and AB are choosing. Oh, the catcher glove. You only get three items. And the tape. The tape does not count. Okay. Here we go. Have unlimited tape. Yes. Okay. But do they have to build it in two minutes too? You guys have to build it in two minutes. No, 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 no. no, no. You're thinking too much in theory. The bra? Yeah. One, one minute 30 left. Okay. Well, we have to build it next time, too? Okay, three minutes to build it. Okay, okay, good. So, good. Okay. I got it. All right, you guys. Okay. This, this, this. And we'll wrap it with this. And we got limited tape, but we have one more item. No, we got three items. Oh, okay, this? okay, come on, come on, come on. Okay, what do we got? What did Where's you get? So, eggs. <laughs> you guys. Eggs? I'll get it. Oh, we don't have eggs? Wait, pause the time, pause the time. Pause it. Where's the egg? Where's the eggs? Pause. I said bring the eggs out. Yeah, the eggs, the eggs are meant to be here. Hello. Well, hold on, you gotta pause, we gotta pause the time. There's no eggs! It's an egg on. drop! Okay. Not an air drop. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so I think you guys had done like 40 seconds, is that right? Or a minute? Cut them off. You can just leave the eggs on the table there. Yeah. Okay, great. All right, so uh, go ahead, start the clock, Ian. Thank you, Sam. We go. Uh, 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 Ian, you got the clock. <laughs> Cracking my balls, man. Best show on the, best show on the internet, folks. Good night. All right, I'm gonna start on mine. You have two minutes, okay? okay. Go. Go. All right, we have two minutes. So what do we got? Yeah, we got yeah. the oh, cloth. What is that? Is a what is that? A diaper. A diaper, a styrofoam cup, and a bag of cotton balls. Okay. Do you need to rip pieces for you? Yep. Okay, so AB mm -hmm. is furiously shoving those cotton balls in. Good form. Good teamwork. Lena right. is preparing. So the yeah, egg is inside okay. the styrofoam. Is that what's going on? Yep. Okay, so they have the egg. Bigger. Oh. Wait, I'm not that big. Jesus. Okay, hold on. Yeah. Look. You don't need your teeth. Time. You have um. Hold on. You have a minute twenty. Okay. That's a lot of time. Okay. You guys are looking pretty good on time. Okay. Now the styrofoam cup okay, is being no, wrapped really in a big, diaper. Really okay. It's like smaller now. No, big, 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 oh, big, 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 big. Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. You understand <laughs> the words that are coming out of my no, mouth? I never do. <laughs> Okay, and the she doesn't. That's this not is just a diaper. Now they're wrapping wait, wait, hold on. it. Wait, okay, hold on. Now, let's just wrap up. It's okay. We have unlimited tape. Okay. You have one minute left. You have one minute left. Yeah. So they're just going hardcore on the tape here, guys. What else could you, should we use? I mean, that's, that's it. That's all you. Wait, yeah. we, we could use this whole bag. Yeah. Yep. That whole bag is yours. Put it. Put it. One big one. One big one. <laughs> you have 45 seconds. All right. Good. My God, you guys. Maybe unlimited tape was a mistake. <laughs> we gonna have any tape left okay, after hold on, this? Hold on. <laughs> Do you need any more? No, I think it's good. This is a whole fucking we got, thing. We got, we got time. That we got, egg is not breaking, y'all. We got time to 
chill? To chill, man. Yeah. We're good. You want to call it? It's you. Yeah, call yeah. it. We don't let's, need it. Let's make sure. Cut them off. How much time do we have? 20 seconds. Yeah, oh, come on. It. Just, just stuff it while we can. And Cut again, this off. is the advantage of the uh, number one. I knew someone was going to grab those cotton balls. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God, the tape. When the yeah. tape is stuck. But I think the challenge really <laughs> begins on the next round. Yeah, AB, you guys use a whole roll of tape, huh? <laughs> Wait, do we have any more have tape? Okay, that's it, that's it, that's it. All right. Stop! All right, good teamwork there by AB and Lena. Hold that up for, for everybody. So we have a styrofoam cup with the egg in it, mm -hmm. surrounded by a cotton balls. In a diaper. Taped up in a diaper, in a cotton ball bag, taped up. Mm -hmm. Let me get a hold of that. How, how much are we weighing here? Oh yeah, you're this, gonna have to open that is, later. This it's thing is light, boy. This thing, is, there's, this is not breaking. I almost wonder if somebody else, not on the team, should be the one to uh, toss it. Should I? Just, I want to like throw this at the wall. That's what I'm saying. Throw it. <laughs> like we need to. All over the wall. By the way, Ethan and Ela. <laughs> uh, Ela just asked me. Teddy asking, "What are you doing?" Cute. Aww. Teddy, we're doing an egg drop. It's a game where we have to protect the egg as much as possible and then throw it at the wall or drop it really high and see if it doesn't break. And so that's the game. Hi, Teddy. I love you. How are you? Hi, Teddy. I miss you. Yeah. Yeah, see you, I see say, you soon. Lena should say hi. <laughs> All right, so let's step into here and we'll see what's the best way to, to challenge this. So let's go. Okay, so we have this ladder set up, but you know, I feel like most of these are gonna survive that. So one thing I can do is maybe toss it all the way up to the roof. From the from the ladder though. Well, what's the difference if I throw it up here? I guess. Same thing, it's the less risk of death. <laughs> all right, ready? So I'm gonna throw it up at the roof. Here we go. Oh. I don't think that, I, there's no I shot that broke. No. Wait, now do we check it out? Yeah, check it out. Okay. Let's get some scissors yeah. and. Yeah, it's very delicate. There's no way that broke. Feeling confident? Yeah, I am hope so. Hope my baby's okay. That's what I thought. Oh, okay. talking to me. Where's the scissor? Oh, Lena, I think the scissors are on the table. We're always prepared here at the H3 Podcast. I'll be, I'll, I'll get it started. I didn't hear a crack. I didn't hear anything. I think you're gonna- That should survive. Yeah, that survived. I appreciate the confidence, guys. You had a whole bag of cotton balls. Be more impressed if it broke. Here. Okay, here we go. You want to do it? No, go for it. My shaky ass hands, I might crack it going in. Oh, God. Okay, here we go. Oh, my God. Drum roll. Here we go. Okay, here we go. And here we go. And here we go. All right. Let's check back in with them. <laughs> yep. <laughs> <laughs> really fucked that thing up. <laughs> okay. They really took really that. Here we go. Tape oh, come on. Here we go. All the way, didn't oh, they? Oh, I'm seeing diaper. I'm seeing diaper. They are. Oh yeah, down baby. To the diaper. We need to wrap the quartering up in one of these. You know what I'm saying? Maybe perhaps too wrap much tape would do. Oh um, my but god, I feel like I'm judge. smuggling drugs or something. Okay. Be gentle. I am, I am. I'm always gentle. Baby's gonna cut the egg right shaking. in half with those two. I'm always right. shaking. Shaky and gentle. Here he goes. Oh, I did almost <gasps> pierce the egg with the scissors. Oh. oh. Wait, did he break it? He, he almost did. did. Almost. For, for There's a big hole in the styrofoam cup. Be careful. I'm, I'm, I'm careful. Okay, he's getting into it now. Talk to me, baby. Talk to me. Let's see. She did it. Yeah, there baby. it is. Intact. It is. It's a little baby. Okay. Well done, guys. <laughs> I'm okay, okay, AB, hold, hold on to that egg, because we're going to need that in round two. That's your That's egg. egg. Okay, here, I'll put it right here. All right, Dan, me and you are next. <laughs> I have a great idea, Dan. I think you're going to love it. Is there any tape left, or did they use all of it? There, there is tape. Okay, good. Maybe, maybe less tape though <laughs> for future contestants. But I appreciate what you guys did. You guys played within the rules. Okay, Dan, you ready? Let's do this. 
Okay, so um, Ian, whenever you're ready. There we go. Okay, so I'm feeling, dude, just put it in the loaf of bread. Just like shove just it in Just put it there. in the loaf of bread. Okay. Like, how good is that? Yeah. You need anything. But, like, it's since we have, I want to mess it. secure it. Yeah, we got to secure it. So, should we wrap it in maxi pad just for the last? For, like, a bra? I like the maxi pad wrap. Okay. The pork and beans is pretty fire. That's going to hit hard, That's, though. Mm, yeah. Jello. You know what you could do is put it in a. Oh, that's good. That's good. Put it in the jello in the bread. <laughs> okay. That's good. That's funny. Okay. Uh, it's been that. 30 yeah. seconds. All right. Let's do that. Okay. Good. Can, um, we, do, can so we do two minutes? Let's. All right. Okay. So let's. Here, let me. I, I'm going to keep the plastic. So let me open this okay. delicately. And then here, okay, hand me the egg, please. Don't we want to do the jello? Yeah, yeah, first? yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. okay. I'll start getting some tape. Oh, man. You Cut them off. Those. <laughs> you used a lot of this. Yeah, just shove it in there. One minute. And then, oh my God. Is that okay? Yeah, get in. And then close it. Wait, we only have one minute? What are you talking about? Oh, it's, hurry it's up. It's been one minute. Oh, it's, it's been one. one Where's the fucking tape? Where's the ridge? Oh, Jesus. Where's the ridge? Oh, here it is. God. Here it is. Here it is. All right, so let's tape. <laughs> close the jello. All right, looks pretty good, actually. Okay. Here, let's just. We don't need a lot of tape. Is that good jello? It's a little too sweet. Really? Yeah, yeah. I find that problem. That happens a lot. Dude, this thing ain't breaking in that jello. That's already good enough, bro. Yeah, you could throw this off the fucking building and it won't <laughs> break. All right, so now we're going into the bread. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Now, Love should it. I carve out the bread or just shove it in there? I think just get it between there like a like a stacked ass sandwich. Yeah, okay. There it is. So we're going to put that there, right, right there. Yeah. Okay, get that. Thank you. Get thank you, thank you, thank you so much. Get that bread boy, get that bread boy. Thank you, thank you. All right, All right. Now, let's, now let's, I think, shove, kind of just... Brick come? Yeah, just brick brick it up there. All right, uh, 60 seconds left. Oh, God. All right, so, so, oh, shit. I, gotta, I think I got to let the air out. Yeah, like that. Okay, good. So just, yeah, wrap that, wrap that up. And we're going to want to get it the long way so it stays nice and tight. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I don't think we need more than that. Do it really tight around the, the long way there. Okay, okay. Good, 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 good. The go. tape drops. Okay, I'm going to go grab the tape when this is done. We have still have about 30 seconds, so. We got time, we got time. I'm feeling good just on the, that bread, but let's complete the. Look at that. <laughs> Dude, this Dude, is not fucking Hell breaking. Hell nah. We're good. Hell nah. Hell fucking nah. All right, 20 seconds. We got it. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. It's done, dude. It's done. Call the contest now. Look at that. 10 Come seconds to spare. Woo! Nice. Baby! Nice. Mm. Mm. All right. All right, let's do this. Stop! Yeah? Thank you. Thank you. All right. That's a genius egg right there. Wow. All right, so who wants to sh slam this thing? No, you're operating the camera. All right, we good? Yep. We're hearing this? All right, so just sl hit it on the roof and then it'll come down and we'll call it a day. All right, here we go. Perfect. Ooh, that felt hard. <laughs> <laughs> that felt really hard. Oh. Okay, this one's actually All right, I'm a lot less confident now. All right, where's the scissor at? <laughs> Okay. Uh, to be fair, you threw that hard, <laughs> but I think the problem is, is it has a lot of weight, and yeah, so it hit no, the ground really true, hard. That's true. That but thought, I, that thought sounded <laughs> bad. But I think it's gonna be fine. All right, here's the Jello. Okay. All right. Look at this shit, Amy. Oh, that look, yeah. it looks, it looks think intact. Okay. Yeah, I think, I think we're gonna be okay. I don't want to break it on, on the, on the extraction process. Yeah, prolapse. Ooh. Howie Mandel. Scary. It's oh scary. shit, I think it's broke. No! Okay, hold on, hold it's on. It's broken, Careful look. extraction. No, don't mess this. Hold on. <laughs> I can't fucking believe it. The fortress of the fortress. It's like surgery. Open the wound. Oh shit. Oh it, god, here, my just, friend here, Neil. Dump it, dump it. You can put it in here. <laughs> just take it out, man. Yeah, it's cracked, bro. It's fucking cracked. Oh, oh no! I can't believe this! Oh. Why is this happening to me? <laughs> wow. Huge fail. All right, well, we're eliminated. That's it. Dude, no! Fuck! Shit! 
Why is all this happening? Oh, yeah. Come stand in front of the table. Oh my god. I'm so fucking pissed! I can't believe it. Why do bad things always happen to good people? Are you crazy? Are you out of your mind? I think the biggest factor there was the weight. You want to keep it light. Mm. Thank you for the tip. I don't know why I'm helping you guys. So what happened? You swapped out for love since you're here physically? I just have arms. Yeah, mm -hmm. arms I is good. That, that might be helpful. So Max and Olivia are the new team here. And love, obviously. Let us know your thoughts. Yeah, you're yeah, on this yeah. team as well. No, pirate. no, no. That's cheating. Okay, that's cheating. No, I'm just kidding, love. You can help. But let's be real. <laughs> Do it imperfect. All right, no, I'm kidding, love. Yeah, you, you, love, you're, you're yeah, with yeah. them. You're, you're with them. He can be your avatar, Thank you. Max. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Families just come in all different time. shapes yeah. and sizes. They say. Families do. Just has a big team we got these guys. That's right, so true. So when the clock is ready, Ian, let me know. People are saying who is Max. Max is the uh, trading the card, card guy. guy. Yeah. yeah. If they I miss, my life if they miss the Max, beginning, so yeah. <laughs> yeah. Are you ready, Ian? All right, guys, go. Okay. All right. They got a big bra. Maybe show the table more, what's going on on the table. Yeah. So we got the bra. We got, what is, what's in that bag there? Baby socks. Okay, that, that could be useful. Shaving cream. Can you stand on the other side? Maybe stand on the other side of the table so you can see the stuff on the table. Yeah. Yeah. Show the table. So we got a bra, we got marshmallows and maxi pads. Okay, interesting combo. So wait, can they have unlimited maxi pads? That seems fine, right? Yeah. Yeah, okay. So we've got marshmallows, a giant bra, and maxi pads. I don't know. Guys, you have two minutes. Good egg. Go. And an egg. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And the egg, of course. So I'm gonna wrap the egg in a few pads first. Okay, that's best. good. And those are max flow or light flow pads? These are max flow. Okay, good. That'll These be helpful. heavy dude. Those, that'll be helpful for mm -hmm. sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, the egg has heavy flow. The so. egg has a heavy flow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, and, and you guys are have down to about one and a half minutes. I don't want to talk about it. So get wrapping. Should we do another? Yes, one more. Love, one do you have any more thoughts more on their approach here? Mm, like no. So perfect. <laughs> that so actually perfect. looks solid. That, yeah, that looks, looks solid. Great. And, and then it feels light, too, here, which is key. We have all the marshmallows. We have marshmallows. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, what size cup is that, bra? I would hit it with probably a D. Oh, that's so that's a that's a that's a big bra. And it's a push up too, which means it's extra good. Now, why do you need a push up if you're size D? Oh, good for the lift, I guess. Yeah, the lift yeah. also, you know, the sleigh of it all. <laughs> okay, okay. That looks have very we, good, very promising. Hold on, have Max, we I'm tried the marshmallows? Really yeah, 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 yeah. I, I think know, one, minute minute one minute. One minute. So real. Uh, love is asked a question. Time. What's up? Have we tried, taste tested the marshmallows? No, but I'll, I got it. Oh, yeah, yeah. All right, good. Can I have one? Uh huh. Those are good. That's 40 important. seconds. Dan, I can't believe I broke. That's just bullshit, bro. I think Dan's got to throw them all from now on with the same velocity. Cut them off. 20 seconds. That looks yeah, very, yeah. very We promising. should have done this from the beginning. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is much better. More, more, more. <laughs> done. That's it. 10 That's seconds. It. Done. Are you going to call it? Okay. Yeah, we're done. There it is. Stop! So ultimately, we have an egg wrapped yep. in maxi pads. In marshmallows. Wrapped in marshmallows in a, in in a, a size D bra. In a size mm -hmm. D bra with duct tape. With yeah. duct tape. Yeah. yeah. That, yeah. All right, hey, to give that to Dan. He's going to be the master slammer today. Competition is fierce here, ladies and gentlemen. Um, oh. 
people want me to use the ladder, I have a feeling I'm gonna die. I'm using the ladder. Yeah, our, you are, but it hits the... I'm it's gotta hit throw. the roof. I'm gonna spike it. Oh. No, spike it. Yeah. I'm gonna spike yeah, it. Yeah, spike it, spike it, spike it. He's right, he's right. He's right. I'm pissed ours broke. Spike it, Dan. Are we ready? Yeah. Don't. What the fuck? All right, here we go. Dan. <laughs> so, so Dan threw it at the ground, not as hard as he could, but I didn't want to be I I think it's I don't think it's broke. There wasn't a big impact there. Yeah, eh? it felt soft. Yeah, I think we're good actually. We should just Uh-oh. Uh comment says <laughs> push up bras have great padding, so that was a good choice there. I think you guys are going to be in great shape. This game is going to really you. heat up yeah, in the next round when all the good ingredients are gone. Here we go. Oh, oh, this is gonna take a sec, low key. Yeah. Use it. Uh, you guys have the scissor, right, Olivia? Yeah. Yes. Yeah, so, the next round is gonna be really interesting because I'm looking at some of these ingredients, and there's a way to make it work, but they're not gonna be easy. So, Dan, tell me about how hard did you throw it? Well, I felt like because I was up high. You know, I already had the added velocity provided by uh, being at the top of the ladder. So you think that's better than throwing it at the roof? <sighs> I, I felt the floor shake from over here, from the impact. I mean, of it. It you felt the floor shake. I mean, I felt you know oh, some gosh. impact of it. <laughs> it seemed like a people big are hit. saying audio. Everyone's saying audio. Echo. It's picking up on the thing over there. Who, so who you, are you talking to? Who's my? Uh, who's, me? Yeah. What did yeah. I do? I'm sitting right here. Oh, oh, their mic's picking me up. Yes. Okay. Okay. Oh. okay. I'll just not talk. Okay. An intact egg. Good job, guys. Hold on to that egg. Good job, team. You're gonna need that in the next round, which I am not in. Because Dan had to slam ours on the roof. You told me to. <laughs> All right, who is number four? Number four, up next. Oh, it's Ian. Okay. Um, you know, I thought me and Dan and coming together on the, the same team would bring us together, but it turns out he was, he was willing to sabotage even himself mm -hmm. to get back at me. Sam and Ian. Stepping up. Competition is fierce. We have two competitors moving forward. Sam and Ian, how are you guys feeling today? Good. We're not allowed to look over here yet. No. But no. you yeah, but you guys we, set we it up. Everything. Yeah, you yeah. bought everything. You know it's there. But okay. All right. Whenever you guys are ready, Dan, you got the timer there? Or do you want me to do it? Okay, guys. We got it. One, two, three, get after it. Go. Okay. It's egg it's egg drop time. I I'm, I like the shape of the I'm not, hmm. The cooked ham. What about, let's see, the cups are gone. What about if we take the... I might, okay. I, what about the bean? We put it in the middle of the bean. I think we should empty the cup. Okay. The sponge is around the cup. Okay. And then cut this and then we put the egg around the maybe closer you're the crap so the audio is good so so wait we want to lock in the sponges the hair and this so okay okay i don't know can you hear them well i don't know all right so we got right. sponges we got ramen soup interesting cup egg. of noodles and uh cooked ham okay wow now this is really interesting I'm popping this open right okay you got yeah two minutes left now okay. oh God, it is that so what smells worse, that or pika fish? It's not that bad. It can't be that I bad. I don't like it. Now, are these Save rough the sponges cat. or soft sponges? What's the texture? They're there? pretty soft. I'd okay, say. okay, okay. So, okay, okay. So now are Sam we putting has this in there. Interesting. So Sam got rid of the ramen. The new. Oh my goodness! That is just a whole brick of ham right there, dude. They're putting the ham in the cup. Of noodle. Do we want to just nest? That's a cup of ham it? right there, boy. Put it in. Okay, the egg is going in between careful, the. Careful. Now they're gently putting the ham and the egg into the cup. 
My hands are shaking with it, 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 it's a it's a high tense moment, Ian. Uh, you know. Okay, so that so you guys shove that full of ham, mm -hmm. but pack it tight. Pack, pack it, it tight, tight like ham chew. Oh, they take a bite to keep the energy up. How's that taste, Ian? A minute. It's good. You have one minute left, guys. You better hustle. Okay. All right. All right. Yeah, you guys are running out of time. Oh my god, we need napkins. I didn't think fifty about seconds. What you put on top. Oh, put sponge. No. Um, Cut them off. Uh oh, this is getting hectic. Oh, fuck. Here, you try and. Uh, Forty seconds. This is getting hectic. Oh no. There's tissue here. I can't get it. Oh no, That's the it. shaky hands. You gotta do it. You gotta. They can't get the tape out. Thirty Cut seconds. Them off. Cut them off. Oh, yeah, Sam is struggling because of the ham juice. Okay, she used her teeth. She got it undone. Sam is using the ham juice to lubricate the tape. Okay, the, uh, the sponge, just two sponges on the top. Okay. We're 15, wrapping it. 15 seconds. Oh my God. You guys got... Uh, 10, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Doctor, doctor. Hands up, hands up, hands up. Oh! Stop! Stop! All, right, all right, we gotta cut. We gotta cut the yeah. tape here. Do we have a? <laughs> I appreciate that, Dan. You gotta see. You gotta lay the law down. <laughs> okay. All right, let's take a look at this oh. thing. This is an interesting one. Again, as we go deeper in the game, the cha it gets more challenging. Now, uh, can I take off. a look yes. at this? This is very interesting. You guys made. So we have an empty cup of noodles, stuffed. What about it? It's not green at all. Okay. Well, yeah. So, um, stuffed with canned ham. Yes. And covered in sponges. This one has got a lot of weight to it. So I'm wondering. It's a little grenade. I'm wondering how it's gonna go. But Dan, it's your job now to. Uh, I can't, I'm okay. Okay. Yeah. I'll oh do it. God. No. 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 Dan, no, Dan no. throws it harder than me. <laughs> Dan's the egg destroyer. We are so done. Oh shit. Oh my god, this is like pretty steep, bro. Don't fall. Thanks, man. You went all the way up? Yep. Oh shit. This is gonna be the real egg drop. You're gonna <laughs> My ass already looked like Humpty Dumpty. <laughs> Are the kings been here or what? <laughs> Fuck. This is scary. I don't like ladders. Oh, it smells. It's bad. All right. You guys ready? It I'm just so smelling bad. my hand. All right. So, like, Dan, like a medium throw? Uh, me medium heavy. Oh, okay. <laughs> I think it's good. Yeah. It could I think actually it's good. be fine. Okay. Which is super impressive. Very delicate. <laughs> it's so difficult to remove all of our good tape work here. I mean, that, that was a good throw. You know, lots of, there's a good impact there. It smells like it the cat food. <laughs> Dude, I'm gonna be so excited for you guys if that's not broken. Let's go! <laughs> Idiots. Who got out? Next. Okay, so that was four. Now we're moving on to five. Great job, Sam and Ian. True competitors in every sense of the word. And I threw that boy. I'll tell you what, man. I didn't show no mercy on that ham bomb. <laughs> All right, so up next is Zach and Cam. Is that right? That's right. That's right. The our last so our final team here. Mm -hmm. And then we're going to go off to the next round. We'll repick numbers because the order is going to really come into factor there. Uh huh. And um, hopefully we'll be naming an egg champion here. Hey, uh, Cam and Zach, how are you guys feeling? You're last, so obviously at a disadvantage. Last is the best, my friend. Yeah, we're creative. We can get this. We can make this That's work. That's true. Two creative geniuses here. Dude, it's like SpongeBob and Patrick Karen for now. There you go, SpongeBob. Yeah. <laughs> I, guess, I guess we know which one Zach is. Um, <laughs> Timer's right. Do that again, Kim. 
It's, that's how Tom Kenny does it. He goes, ah, and he like. Oh, really? Yeah, that's what he does. Yeah. Ah, oh, shit. Ah. All right. You got the, you got the Glock ready, uh, Ian. All right, guys, on your set, go. Three minutes on the clock. Are those Takis? Or, those are Takis or Pringles? You know, I tried Takis for the first time last week. Uh -huh. I did not like them. Didn't care for the Takis. The huh? flavor was insane. This is controversial. Do you like hot Cheetos? I love hot Cheetos. And you Bad. did not like Takis. Yeah, because the talk is too sour. It's like too much lemon. You can catch heat in the comments for this Lime one. Lime is so important. I know I think people the love. The texture is also really bad on Takis. Dude. What is this slander Flaming against Takis? Flaming hot Cheetos. I love. Have are you ever had the good. fries? Yeah. The Flaming hot Cheeto they're fries. They're good. They're good. Not a big fan. They're okay. Yeah, they're okay. <laughs> okay. Wow, these guys selected fast, so we got Hanukkah wrapping. Um, a pack of Takis, and then what, a uh, donuts. Yep. You guys got padding. tape too, I'm Wait, assuming. Put the egg in there. Fuego. Hey. Yeah, put it in there. So, so are you using the Takis that are in there? Yes. Okay, interesting. Uh -huh. And Takis are pretty hard, aren't they? Oh! <laughs> Cam just broke the egg! No! Cam! Wait, 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 that's not fair. We gotta get a new one. Cam just broke the egg! Alright, alright. Come on! Just use a different egg, it's fine. Get a new egg. It's fine. That's really funny, though. Oh my god. I love aren't, you, Cam. Aren't Takis hard? Uh, we're gonna find we're gonna out. We're gonna find out. Okay, so you're padding the fall with the donuts. <laughs> and then we're gonna use Power of the Jew, you know? Interesting. Crack, no, we this got is this. not, I'm not feeling great about it, but, you know. No, it's, just put it in there, man. Yeah. Not too hard, Zach. Just crack yeah. <laughs> Dude, if you broke it again, Zach, I can't. No. No. Did you break it? No, we're good. Okay, okay. We're good. We're good. Well, you have a minute 30. You guys are gonna win the whole tournament, watch. Yeah, shove, shove that does uh, Hanukkah. We don't have the Joker brain for this. All right, so we're all packed up. <laughs> Bitch up, man. You know what? You never know. This could work out for you guys. All right, I'm going to hold it down. I'm going to hold it down and just tape the fuck out of it. Oh, yeah. I feel like this could, it really depends how it hits the this ground. This is some think, MacGyver but. shit right here, my guy. Yeah. All right, there it is. You guys have one minute. We need more tape. Let's More donuts. Tape this on the <laughs> <laughs> it's some extra padding. Right, oh, on, interesting. You know, not a bad idea. Yeah. Which way? Should we go vertical or horizontal? Uh, vertical. Like that? How many donuts are in there? You could you could place them around strategically. Or, yeah, they're. I don't think strategy is out the window here today, you folks. Do Forty seconds. <laughs> Come on, we got this, baby. Leave the tape on there. Oh, okay, I like that. No, you can't do that. You gotta you gotta cut it off. Tape is tape. It's not Egg. an impact object. Alright, I think we're done. Wow, that ended 30 right, seconds take, early. Look at, look at that. Now this is, this is interesting. It's like a gravity bong. Now it's got a little weight to it. I like that the donut impact thing there on the side. Yeah, you better hope it lands on that so side. So we have though. Takis, which are pretty hard. Uh, yeah, well, we don't have much to work with. What are you using? Yeah. Rubber duck instead? Mm -hmm. Rubber ducky? I don't know. Yeah, yeah, I mean obviously, yeah, the, the options are limited. You got the egg, and then the Hanukkah. Uh, <laughs> Power of the Jew, my yeah, friend. Yeah. So, uh, People are saying it's crazy enough to work. I think it's so. I think crazy it actually son of a work. bitch. So here it is. Should I do it, Dan, or you want to do it? Uh, I can go back to show. doing it. Yeah. Okay. You should still come over here, though, for the sake of audio. Okay, though. so I get that doubling effect. Dan is going up, and he is going to slam this motherfucker into the earth at medium to hard strength. When you throw it, can you say time to fly? Sure. Come on! Woo! Okay, here we go. Slam that bitch. I'll put a little, yeah. little English on this one. A little spin? A little spin ski? Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. You're, you you could have got more impact than that. Wait, you got to shock it. I'm arc it. He chose to arc Okay, Dan's don't got it. Fuck that. I'm just saying, everyone been through the ringer here. You guys don't get a free pass. Yeah, they're not getting a free pass. Time to fly. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> All right. Okay. Okay. Yeah. I. You know what? I think there's a good chance you guys are gonna survive this. Here, I'll do it on the tarp. Do it on the tarp. Okay. Here we go. Here, cut this. You okay. Yeah. Time to fly, Dan said. And certainly it was that. Um. Okay. We're ripping open the the duct tape here. The truth lies in the talkies, my friends. 
right. Come on, power the queue, baby. Go. Here we go. Come on, baby, didn't break. I feel like uh, that shit's that shit's cracked as fuck. Oh no, it's yeah. cracked. Oh. Cracked as fuck. Get, can we get, get a shot, shot in there? Yeah. No. Oh. Just dump it. No. And I wanted to eat those. Dump yeah, dump it, out. It, out. dump it out. Just dump it out. Oh god, that thing is just <laughs> devastated. Fuck, dude. Yeah. Nice well. try. All right. Here we go. Nice try. And hold on, before right, we, we uh, hand, but let's do a fist bump. Before we go back to here, fist bump first. Get that mm -hmm. out of the way. Thank you. Um, come over here. Follow me real quick. There's been an incident. We lost I made a, a child. A, a you dropped the egg. You guys have no care. Look what you did, <laughs> you, you jerk. Can't break eggs. That's my That's baby! Right. Yeah. Oh, bro, dude. I come in here, you let me in here, I, I ruin your game, out. I ruin the show. You killed my baby. Yeah. The show's over. Wait, what the? Right. The show's Rick. over. All right. Pack it up. Week. Iggy. Party foul, dude. Yeah, killing a baby is a huge party foul. Kill, kill this audio? Let's go back. Well, well, I mean, I mean, Cam, Cam got a freebie, so you guys should get one too, I guess. Look at this milk dud. It's the smallest milk dud I've ever seen. It's so little. It's so little, it doesn't even look like you're holding anything. Okay, so we have left. Nice try yeah. to Cam and Zach. You guys were working. Good effort, good effort. At a handicap there, being the last contestant, but. Love you, Cam. The excitement is really gonna turn up here in our second round. We have left Lena and AB, Olivia and Max, by the grace of God. Wait, no, they're, aren't they out? I said they should get a freebie if Cam oh, got one. Okay. You know, Sam and Ian, is that it? Yeah. Uh, yeah, the, there's three teams. It, you and I got eliminated and Zach and Cam got eliminated. So there's three teams still in this. So we need to randomly select the order again. Okay, here, I'll set that up. Right here. Anyone here from Arizona? You got the paper in there? Yeah. Okay, so we're going to select the order here. And this could, but I'm uh, sorry, the smacking. Sorry, guys. I took the worst fucking candy you could do. Milk duds. Are we using what remaining items are on the table? Yes. For this? Okay. Yes. All right. We have one, three, and five. Those were the only numbers I could find. Okay, go ahead. Okay. And I got five. So Fuck my third. life. You're going last. You ain't first, you're last. Okay. That is the good one, yes. And that means Sam and All right, Olivia and Max, please step up. The championship round. Sorry about the milk duds, guys. I literally chose, I'm like Mr. Ed with peanut butter about here. I don't know why the fuck I chose milk duds of all goddamn things to eat on his, during a live show. <laughs> it's like stuck. It's like fucking. It's brutal. Whoa, 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 whoa! Come on. How are you, how are you gonna milk an oat? I'm ruining. The Get the fuck out of here! All right, guys. This is the championship round. I have a feeling it's gonna turn up. You can only choose from the remaining ingredients there. Three minutes. Mm -hmm. You guys ready? I have a question. Go ahead. If we pick balloons. Is it one balloon or is it because the whole pack? The whole pack. Right. Interesting. I think that we can right. do something with that. You guys ready? Don't yeah. you think so? Yeah, right. of course. <laughs> you guys okay, ready? guys, go ahead. Start. Okay. Go ahead. So are we blowing up all of these? All right, Olivia and Max um, and Love. Thank you, Ethan. <laughs> Olivia has gone straight for the balloon. She's already blowing them. And she's trusted Max to uh, select. Yeah, no, no, I'm not touching the, uh, the eggs. Max selected the coffee filters. Cut them off! You guys have one more item to pick there. Here, I got, I got these. I love the idea... These guys are all over the place. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, know, yeah. I like We're the idea of... of the well, our baby just died. We're still True. dealing with that. Babe, so baby socks. So go ahead and sit, Max. Yay. Okay, I like baby socks. I would like to put our egg in the in the baby pot. Okay. So you guys got balloons, coffee 
uh, baby filters sacks. and baby socks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And what if we like okay. uh, baby wait, what wants? If we just need something like this. That's what I'm. That's yeah, what I'm loving. Yeah, and perfect. then and then balloons like around. One minute yeah. down. Okay. Well, you guys are doing fast great. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So so we're inside the baby sock with the egg. We're starting there. Can I do the other baby socks too? Yeah, Is it all? Get, yeah, whatever item. Thank you. We got a whole collection of baby socks, ladies and gentlemen. How much time they got? I don't see the clock on the screen. They are. There you go, 1.30. We gotta do this. So the baby sock is going in the coffee holder. That looks interesting. That looks interesting. Okay. So the egg is in the coffee and the filters and, the, and then. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a okay, well, you guys have a minute 20 now. It sounds like this is getting pretty complicated. Well, we're complex people. Okay, well, yeah. you have a minute to we're be a co as complex as you want. Beings. Okay, coffee filters are being taped Cut up. Them off. Lots One of minute tape. left. One minute, guys. Rattle your dags. Let's, let's do like... Ah, we need more tape. What's the plan with the balloons there? I'm feeling like maybe like one mm -hmm. here. Are we out of two? Don't think too much about it. Just tape them to the. So, so you guys have about forty seconds left, and we are just going. What is what is this up? Y'all got trying to trying to float away with this? Yeah. I my. my Thirty my seconds. My feeling guys. is that those balloons are not going to do anything because on impact they're just going to get pushed to the side. But I could be wrong. I like the ingenuity certainly. Mm -hmm. That's true. That's true. Yes. I, I could be yes, totally Dan, wrong it about was. this. Listen, I'm a huge William Osman fan. I've 15 seen seconds. Every 15, oh, shit. 15 seconds. <laughs> 15 seconds. It's a terrible day. 10 seconds. 10 seconds. 9, 8, faster, faster, 7, faster. 6, woo, 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 5. You've covered the timer. 4, 3. <laughs> so you covered the timer. 2. <laughs> stop! 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 Don't move! Stop! 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 I think it's stop! Good. This is what I was looking for. All right, hand me that. Let me Actually, take a look at it. This is actually exactly This kind of looks exactly what we intended. Okay, that's perfect then. So we have here, oh, it's very light, so that's making me feel good for you guys. Thank baby you. Baby socks, mm -hmm. egg wrapped yeah. in baby socks, mm -hmm. inside the coffee filters with a couple balloons. Mm -hmm. And then the deflated balloon on the bottom, it's like the rudder. But, I mean, it yeah, it's, it's, little, yeah, yeah. it's gonna help with special. the direction yeah. during the drop, I think. Mm -hmm. All right, let's, do, Dan, do your thing. It's a hidden Mickey. Or you want me to do it? I'll do it. Yeah, you do it. Right. It's a beautiful combination of us both. Right. Yeah. <laughs> Here we go. The real egg drop, as the said. My fat ass cling into this thing. <laughs> like, with sandals on and shit. All right, all right. All right. Here we go. So I'm feeling Dan just at the ground, right? Yeah, sure. Okay, here we go, guys. <laughs> that was pretty good. I didn't like the way that it honestly sounded. Felt, that felt like good for you guys, I think. Did it? I think so, yeah. All right, come get it open. I think the balloons actually slowed it down. <laughs> right. Oh, that lens flare, wow. Oh, this is very cinematic what's happening right now. Yep. Easy. Easy. <laughs> Here we go. I think it's gonna be fun. Did you guys just leave the fucking ham? <laughs> I think it's good. <laughs> it reeks like over so, here. I like the it vibe. It smells so bad. It's so bad. <laughs> oh, I feel a little wet. Uh -oh. oh no. There's moisture detected in the middle, which is obviously not a good sign, but let's see. The baby soft. <gasps> Where'd the moisture come from? Is I don't that? know. The ham, maybe. Oh, the ham. Maybe. Inside the baby sock, what do we have? Wait, <laughs> <laughs> right, now we're even. Now we're even. Now we're even. Oh. <laughs> I feel a lot better. I feel a lot better. That's the second egg you guys broke. <laughs> you are out and shit. Yeah, that I think that's. Oh my god. Ew! Well. You know what? We did a beautiful thing today. Yeah, yeah. you can leave it there. Okay. I like the vibe. Yeah, no, it's cute. <laughs> it is cute. Yeah. She likes it though. She's, yeah, she's, she's with her you. brother. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> she's with her brother.
Olivia, they won the round and dropped the egg. The second egg they've dropped, by the way. Oh, you're frozen, Ethan. One sec. We gotta fix this. They can hear me, though? Yeah. No sanctity for life on that team. Absolutely none. They wow. murder my children. I know, love, ma'am. Yeah, I'm, I'm good. My goodness. How are you feeling, Olivia? Devastated. Yeah. You were so close to this. I feel like we just met our eggs and they're already gone. That's exactly <coughs> how I feel. It feels just like that. Yeah. Yeah. It feels just like literally me when it feels <laughs> like that. All right. Well, unfortunate accident uh, <coughs> aside, you guys are out. That means there's only two competitors left. See you, partners. Um, I believe up next is Ian and Sam. Is that right? <coughs> All right, Ian and Sam, come have a seat. Hmm. One of two teams remaining. <clears throat> yes. The inventory there is getting very low. I know. I'm trying not to look over <coughs> there. And so, um, this is time to get really creative. We're still here. I thought that ham should be I All can't right. believe that didn't break. <laughs> Dude, it was beautifully snug and right at home in that ham. You gotta hold the egg, though. My hands all dropped okay. it. All right. Okay. Are we ready? ready? All right, guys, and build. Okay. Slim Pickens over there. Let's go. They got beans for sure. Ian is wondering if they should go for the Ziploc bags. Wow. Okay, that was a quick decision. So they picked Ziploc bags, a can of of baked beans. Are those genuine uh, English beans or fake ones? No. Uh, no, no, no. Bullshit. And do you think the bullshit beans are better at impact? Wait, 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 wait. Or? Okay. We should put... And shaving cream. Well, I'm thinking... We'll put the cream... Well, here. Maybe we'll put one of these eggs. <laughs> okay, now watch the... Uh, I can't... At this stage of the game, I can't forgive accidents, guys. Now load it up. Okay, so Sam is squirting... Wait. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay, oh, while you do I got that... It, I got it. Sam is squirting the shaving cream into the bag. <laughs> Get it, get it. Interesting. Uh, you have one. You, uh, you're, you have two minutes left. That two minutes sweet left. Milk. That was here, here. Let me put some in this bag. Why so little? Trust the process. Trust the process. Sam says in response to my inquiry. Drop it, drop it in there. So right. we're getting some bag and foam section here. Yeah, Sam is just Exploding. okay. Nope. I should trust Sam. She is our prop master. She knows what she's doing. Can we, do you think we're, is that good? Think? I think that's good. Okay. They have, oh, no. they have three bags full of foam, and at the heart of it, Here, an egg. Please. Okay. What's happening now? Interesting. I'm going to do it one more time. Sam is okay. coating a bag. And then are we going to push You guys it have in the one beam? minute 20. One minute 20. Sam is doing this one more. It's working as I thought it was going to work. <laughs> It's too slippery. Sam is attempting to insulate it with okay. a. Okay. Okay. Now. Oh wow. Well. Wait. That coffee pot's not yours, brother. That's not, I'm just putting it. There okay. 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 Good. Okay, good. 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 That's fine. <laughs> so we, they Stop have. Put it in the bean bag. I can't. How are you not gonna what, fit what? in there? Trust me. Uh -oh. <laughs> I can't put it in there. That is a tiny can of half I was a can of beans. Cut them off. And Wait. Ian beans. is trying to shove it in a can That's of beans. There's no way it's gonna fit in that. Yeah. 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 Look out. Okay. So he's pouring. He's pouring <laughs> beans and shaving cream in a bag. Okay, and then that one oh, goes. Oh, we gotta lift some of the air out. We're running low on. Forty the seconds, there. guys. We're good. We're this good. is definitely our most interesting round good. yet. I mean, this is good stuff. All right, we're down to our thirty <laughs> seconds here. Ian's got, sh Ian's got shaving foam, but he got the tape open. Does does duct tape stick to uh, wait, 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 wait. shaving foam? We'll find out gotta today. Got to put it in this bag. Wow, okay, this is really something. We only got twenty guys. seconds. This is good. No, this is good. Fifteen seconds. Uh, it's in there. Fifteen seconds. Uh, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Stop! 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 <laughs> okay. Okay, guys. Well, we gotta I gotta cut, say, we gotta cut the tape. Um, this is, I would say, the most interesting shell we've had yet. Okay. Now right, let me take a look. You want to hand that over to him? Yeah, please. Yes. 
Very delicate. Be very careful with that. All right, so, wow, this is just... You know, this could, this could work. I'm going to be real with you guys. There's a lot of, of padding in here. So you have the egg in the middle of several bags full of shaving cream. And then the final bag stuffed with uh, beans, beans and shaving cream. Yes. Wrapped in duct tape. Yes. I think this is going to work, you guys. We'll see. Sure Dan, you want, to, I'll, you want me to I'll do this? You got it. Yeah, I'll put your hand in. All right. Holy shit. Woo, that smells. All right, I'm approaching with my hands covered in shaving cream. Here we go. Humpty Dumpty. <laughs> Climbing up this bitch. I gotta take off my sandals next time because yeah. those are get way more sketchy. All right, you guys. All right. Okay, Here we go. Good. This could be for the dub, you guys. Here it comes. Shit. Fly. Oh, it hit the hand. The hand <laughs> saved y'all. Oh, the hand. It slammed on Wait, the hand. They left the hand. Yo, but it exploded though. Chestnut checkers, my friend. <laughs> okay, this is the beans. Oh. Wait, all right, here we go. It smells kind of good over here. Yeah, the same cream is very aromatic. I think you guys are gonna be fine. That one, that... This is the best unboxing. It didn't really feel like it hit the ground super hard. Okay, go to open these. There's lots of layers to this one Everyone's, here. My hands are, here, yeah, I can't I do it, I'm done. Don't throw the bag down. Careful. Yeah, Ian's definitely gonna It's a it. battlefield in here. It's dangerous. <laughs> it's not so it's easy, so right? Slippery. Maybe the scissor, eh? Very Just careful. No, no. I got it. Okay, delicate, all right. delicate. Moment of truth. Oh, do I see yellow? I thought I saw yellow. Wait. <laughs> careful. Maybe let's run it under the water and see. I think it's, I think it's, okay, let's see. Okay, we're gonna run it under the water. Uh, it's too close to fall. What do we see? That egg is good. Let's go! Woo! Yep, that's a whole egg. Damn, that was impressive, y'all. <laughs> that ham saved you, though. Nah. That ham. That was, that was the ham of God right there. <laughs> Reached out. <laughs> we're, all ahead, you could clean. We're, we're all in line to wash our hands here. The shaving cream. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Okay, baby. Hope you're plotting, AB. You're thinking of the moon. So hungry. Yeah, I mean, I have to even aim for the hand. All right, come on back. You know, leaving the debris on the battlefield may be Look how much shit's on there now. Well, it's only fair for you guys. So, Ian and Sam survived. <laughs> With beans and shaving cream. Incredible. Ian's just, or Sam's just cleaning up the desk real fast for you guys. Common Sam and Ian dub right there, dude. That could have been the dub, yeah, for sure. Lena, AB, how are you guys feeling? Confident still. That was really impressive of them, but I feel like we could do it. I'm a little worried. I think Team Smelly's gonna take it. <laughs> well, yeah, let's take a look at what's left on the table. <laughs> it's not much. <laughs> Don't forget about the um, sardines. Oh, the Ethan knows from the penguin costume. Excellent. That's disturbing. Some straws and uh, some cookies. Those brownies could be in clutch. And mm -hmm. that's not it. Yeah. All right, guys. Are you? Are, how's the clock? We looking good? All right, Lena and AB. Get building. Let's 
Ready? I'm ready. Okay. All right. Lena and AB, fierce competitors. You let Lena start taking the band-aids and wrapping an egg. Okay, AB is taking the lead here. Lena is going to be wrapping an egg with in band-aids. Band yeah. Or with the, not with the box? They've selected the toilet paper rolls and the why brownies. This, why this tape? Not, oh shit, we don't got good tape? This is good. Uh, it's not as strong, all right. That's good tape, that's fine. Yeah, this is, this is fine. That's fine. So maybe. Um, so. Okay, we'll wrap this. Here, but you need the tape first. Okay, here yeah. we go. They're okay. quick to the table. It's not, it's not tight. Confident and fast. Okay. True competitors. Right here. Okay, he's wrapping. Wow. Okay, yeah, be careful. The band-aids. Not even out of the pack. Keep them in the package, you know? Okay. Okay. So, more band-aids. This is what the bear feels like if you want yeah, to show. Yeah, I'll get the tape. What's that, Ian? Have you watched the show The Bear? The Bear? No. Yeah. It's like a cooking show. It's just like... Oh, really? Yeah. Sounds good. Hey, can you throw me one of those brownies or are you going to need them all? I may need them. <laughs> all right, so... Okay. Start, here, start. What if we execute... It's just band-aids and brownies at this point, right? That's all we've got, really, is band-aids and brownies. That's all we need. Wow. Here. It's a triage down out here, man. These guys are working with purpose. Um, Can you stay, stick with the tape? Time? One and a half minutes remaining. AB is now putting it in the brownie box. Fuck it, he's saying, we'll use it all. Like, I didn't know about this. Go ahead, go ahead. Uh, Alina go ahead. is just stacking the tape like yeah. a true yeah. lieutenant. Cut them yeah. off! Like a true <laughs> general, brigadier general. Okay. Hold on, hold on. They haven't even used now this, the now this. the rolls shit, yet. Shit. Right here. Just yep. going hard on the tape. Are you guys going to use the rolls there? The <laughs> empty toilet paper rolls? Yeah, we'll get to it. We'll get to it. Okay, right so now he's right. he's adding the most. Fifty seconds, guys. Here. That's plenty of time. This is an abomination, but I'm stops. liking it. Lena, get the brown tape. Yeah, start wrapping. Wow, Ian is, or AB is really going for it here. Wow, you go. can you can really go. feel the passion just go. Just wrap it. and these competitors. Give me, give me, give me. The, yeah, the speed and the passion. Oh, you guys have 30 seconds. Calm down. Go, 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 go. <laughs> All right, you guys got four, 20 seconds left. <laughs> AB, the human tape machine. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, yeah, that's fine. That's fine. How much fucking tape this guy no, use? No. I, 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 I. Did he stick to one roll? How many roll he use? Hey. Seven, six, <laughs> five, thank you, four, three, two, one. Okay, stop! 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 stop, stop, stop. We got it. Dude, that looks good. Bring it I over here. Know. Let me see. To be honest, I don't think this one's gonna make it. My concern is that it's heavy. My concern is that the egg is not cushioned enough. My concern it's is you're not gonna hit the meat <laughs> when you throw it. <laughs> <laughs> That's true, that makes a big difference. So, we have an egg wrapped in band-aids. Mm hmm Wrapped in... Stuff. Uh, uh, brown brownies. brownies. Brownies, boxes. And, and then wrapped in uh, toilet paper rolls somehow. Mm hmm But it's all wrapped up and it looks like a Christmas present, so let's go slam it. Wow, it's serious. <laughs> jacket off. Why'd you take the jacket off? And the socks off? <laughs> He's gonna be a completely different person. I was afraid of dying, that's why. Fear of death. All right, guys. You got, no, I should aim for away from the ham. I think you should aim for like, yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Here. All right, guys, here it is. For the championship, Lean in AB for Sam and Ian. <laughs> what the? No oh, bullshit. I think it's fine. <laughs> <laughs> that was the densest drop I think we've had. <laughs> I think it's gonna be fine. <laughs> Bless you. There's a lot to cut through. Jesus. 
The tension is mounting. Oh, it stinks. Two compa- what stinks in there? I mean, that stinks. Oh, that. Okay. Slow down, you don't, you don't want to cut your finger off. Or break the egg. Lena doesn't care about my finger. <laughs> Okay. Can't even get to it. How are you guys feeling? You think the egg's intact? What's what's your thing? I'm thinking? not You're... feeling confident about this. No. One. Yeah. I I think you guys are gonna be fine. I'm hopeful. I'm still hopeful. They cracked. You can tell. No. Yeah. They cracked. Oh, oh, well, we, that means we have a winner. Well, we got weights and fish. <laughs> we got weights and fish. Wow. We got we got ham on the ground. And that means, of course. Here, announce it back at the table. And that means, of course, that we have a champion. Egg Drop Champion 2022. It's Mr. Verified, back at it again. And his lovely partner, Sam. Sam, creative director, prop master. They sure know what they're doing back there. You guys have taken the dub against all odds. <coughs> That shaving cream and bean was a master class in egg dropping. How are you guys feeling right now? So, like, is the ham, the ham's up for, up for grabs, right? Yeah, you can eat that now. Okay, no one throw that away. Uh, Sam's, Sam's the prop. She's the prop queen, you know? Quick thinker. When I saw that, that canned ham at the Dollar Tree, it was like a dollar gambit in my head. Like, <laughs> you were seeing, yeah. you're doing the calculations. Wait, was yeah. that a dollar? The canned ham? Everything here. Not like it. Cent store. You can get a can of ham for a dollar. Yeah, boy. Mm-hmm. Is there lives worth more than that? That's like a huge can of meat. Yeah. I mean, it's like cat food quality, but but yeah. Still, a pig lived for that. Yeah, I agree. It's sad. America, baby. After I got that canned ham. My TikTok algorithm showed me like 20 recipes with that canned ham. Ugh. I should make one. How did it taste? Gross and also kind of creepy. Yeah. Um, it wasn't. It wasn't that bad. That eating like stinky meat. I'm in my zone, man. Mm. That's my element. <laughs> yeah, and I mean compared to a fika, that's got to be a uh, you know like pumpkin pie. <laughs> yeah. Well, this was such a fun time, and I'm just so proud of you guys. So once again, Sam and Ian, say thank hello. You. Say thank you. Mr. and Mrs. Egg Drop 2022. Wow. And, and a gracious thank you to the competitors. There was some juice. Real juice. Real thank juice. You, thank Real you. juicy. Thank you. Juice up. There it is. Congratulations. Thank you, everybody, for joining us. Egg Drop 2022. You guys will be getting the grand prize as a gift card to Sharkies. Yeah. <laughs> right? $20 so you can each get a salmon burrito. The weirdest of all burritos. You still you excited about that? Yeah. Ian, what, thoughts? We, we literally were at Sharky's. What was that, like four days ago? I've been hitting up Sharky's recently. I'm not really? Gonna you guys are yeah, back on the yeah, Sharky's yeah, train. It's good. It's good. It hits our. <laughs> Yo, can I recommend something to you, Ian? Yeah, yeah. They yeah. have this Mexican pizza. <laughs> it's so fucking good. Like, it's just, it's ridiculous. It doesn't make sense. I and, can't believe you got back on the Sharky's train. You haven't. You haven't told us this. Yeah, yeah I know. This, this is a big I, development. I've been embarrassed, but I'm back on it. <laughs> You're embarrassed. Wait, keep going. What is it? Try the Mexican pizza. It's like the super thin. It's like a chick barbecue chicken pizza, super thin bread, and it's like amazing. Mm. Wait, has no business being that good. Mm. Let me pull up a picture so everyone knows what to yeah. get for dinner. Okay. <laughs> yes, Sharkies. For those of you that are not familiar, is a uh, fast food Mexican place. Not fast food. How dare you say that? It's fast food. It is not fast food. Stop Notoriously it. Notoriously mediocre, also. One Look could at this. argue. Some would say that. Mm -hmm. I think it's. I think it's okay. It's not fast food. It's it's food it's made fast, Dan. <laughs> it's definitely. Fast it's like food. brisk food. It's like a brisk walk. It's food. not. It's like higher quality than McDonald's. It's like real food. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah, I suppose so. In its own way. Dan's not giving me that sharky stuff. <laughs> I think it's I think it's still kind of fast. But try this know. if you if you're feeling adventurous, it's really good. So good. Oh my god. <laughs> Let me see more pictures of it from different angles. You've talked so much shit on sharky. <laughs> yeah, but we ate a lot of sharky. <laughs> it's so good. It's so good. 
God, I would eat this every night. Look at that. And the crust is like crispy, boy. I would eat the shit out of that. Sure would. Well, that was fun. Here is that Dan, by the way, uh, tr trying to break the egg. <laughs> 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 That's my uh, boot. That's my a boot. <laughs> dude, photo. a dude will haunt me for years. Dude. Okay, so I, how long we've been going? There's a few of. We've been going for three hours. So let's wrap it. Wrap it. But up. I want to save some of these stories for. Uh, so what's what's our schedule for the week? How uh, Wednesday is Howie. Yeah. Thursday is uh, leftovers as usual, and then Friday is Bradley Martin. Oh. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Um. Yeah. Sorry. Um. <laughs> um. <laughs> So I was confirming with uh, Bradley's people this morning to make sure everything was kosher, and he uh, he can't do Friday anymore. Oh, ow! Friday is not Bradley Martin. What's I'm... next? You gonna sell, sell sell me a BMW? What do we do about it? What's up, Bradley? How did that not get reported to me? It it, it, it it's happened breaking. during the Listen show. Oh, it's breaking news. Yeah, yeah. God, so we're try to reschedule him. Yeah. Well, uh, he's available. Well, we can talk about it. We'll talk about it after the show. People. Okay, so Howie on Wednesday, he is leftovers confirmed. on Thursday, and Friday he'll be here. will be H3 Podcast After Dark with, Original e with Eli flavor. Klein. That's right. Actually, but Howie is going to be... Wait, did you say... Oh. Howie is going to be so fun. I'm so excited. We have surprises for him. We have a whole show planned out for him. Ow. Yeah, it's going to be great. And he's a good guy. We're besties. We can talk about anything. I'm gonna show him my rash, my <laughs> upper you guys thigh. Are best diagnose it for friends, me. absolutely. But um, I want you guys to. I have this one. He's somebody in the chat said Bradley can't make it because he just picked up a new uh, electric uh, BMW that he needs to <laughs> yeah. break in a little bit. Yeah, driver. Fun. I bet. It's very dude. funny, KJM. I bet. Funny. Real quick, I just wanted to say the um, the H3 packs that we had in stock are sold out. <laughs> Super Cooper. Thank you, everyone. Thank you. Thank um, you. Thank you. Everything on the site is a pre-order. It will ship either January or February of next year. Peace and love. Peace and love. Peace and love. Peace and thank love. You. Thank, thank you. Love. you. Well, thank, thank you, you, everyone. To purchase. Um, trading. Just trading. Or Without not. the just. Just trading. Without the vowels, too. Right. No vowels. Trading. No just. Me. Trading. 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 Yeah. Trading. Well, so, so I see some people in chat being confused. There's still more. You can still buy them. It's just gonna be come later in the year. He had a certain year. amount in stock yeah. that were like ready to go. Those have no now sold out. So now, if you order, it will be a pre-order for the second wave of them that's coming. Yes. That's Thank you, Dan. Yep. Yeah. Thanks, Dan. And there are no limited supply on those, correct? There is no limited. Yeah, supply. that one. They will not sell out. It is a pre-order until December third. Uh, at 11.59 Eastern Standard Time. There you Perfect. Go. Bless. Wow. Yeah, it's a great gift. It really is such a fun one. They're excited. Um, so that is that. Um, I wanted you guys to save the chemical peel one. I saw this shit blew my mind. That's perfect after dark content. It's I would so love good. Dilo's take on that. <laughs> right, right. I do too. Um, and then the, the, the creepy guy. I want to do that one too. And, uh, I guess maybe the L the police chase we have time. Lots of good stuff left though. And guys, thanks for watching. Uh, what a fantastic episode. BMW, if you're watching, fuck you, bro. Never again. That's what they said. And yet I trusted you. You know what? Why don't you just take the gold teeth out of my mouth? Pawn them off, you fucks. People in the chat were saying uh, the pin link wasn't working anymore. I'm assuming because that was the link to the... Uh... Yep, I'm, I'm updating it right now. Okay, and I just pinned a, a new link to the pre-order page, and I will link it in the description of the episode, too. So, check oh, it out. Also, I forgot to say, there will be a new See You Next Tuesday tomorrow for members. Thank you, members. How many, uh, how many audios is it going to have? <laughs> three. Going for three. Oh. Got him. Step it up. <laughs> it's going to sound like a... <laughs> Fever dream. Audio, audio, audio. <laughs> um, actually, if you guys have suggestions for See You Next Tuesday, do we have a chat room in Discord for... Suggestions for... Uh, what do you mean, suggestions? I wanted Topic to set up a chat room in Discord for questions and... Is oh, yeah, um... Q&A stuff. Well, there, there 
is a room actually uh, with a lot of that in it. We can talk about it. Uh, well, I want to tell them where to go submit. From everywhere in my room. So we, oh, and it loves room. We have these uh, suggestion uh, channels where people post stuff, but if you want it specifically for See You Next Tuesday, because yeah. it's kind of its own vibe, um, yeah. we could consolidate these. I'll uh, just make the room so I can tell them where to go. Yeah, we'll just have a room open in the Discord. Okay, cool. So if you guys have any questions for room. me, Q&A, life advice, whatever, people want me to talk more about mitzvahs. <laughs> That's true, I didn't make it through all 630 or whatever. Yeah, you can keep going. Um, leave those for me and I'll, I'll, I'm gonna record it, uh, I guess, tonight. And, uh, yeah, so that'll be up for members. Thank you to our members, I love y'all. You guys make it all possible here on the podcast. You make stability here for us and, uh, you all mean everything. So thank you guys. And we'll be back on Wednesday. For members, I will see you next Tuesday. And uh, that's that. Congratulations once again to Sammy and Ian. <laughs> and let me just go um, one last, because I'm seeing, uh, I think we have a lot of new members recently because of all the gifted subs. Thank you so gifted. if you don't, gifted. if you're a member and you don't know how to get in the I Discord, free speech. basically you, <laughs> in Discord, you link your YouTube account that you're a member on to your Discord account. So you go into the settings and you go into the connections tab and link your YouTube account. Oh. Once you've done that, you will automatically see a button to join the server. I have an update. You got an update. Our clickbait was successful. My dad messaged me. Did your car really get stolen or just clickbait? Didn't get that far in the podcast. <laughs> oh, we got him. <laughs> Anyone else get anything from their parents? Uh, my dad has reached out to me a few times in the past when we had some real juicy clickbait. Um, apparently, mom, he dude. does not give a shit about your car getting stolen, though, because he did not send me yeah, a he message on this one. Okay. Or my maybe mom. he's just... Your mom? What'd you say? Was Ethan's car really stolen? <laughs> <laughs> oh, we got two! <laughs> awesome! <laughs> that's really good. Two parents reaching out. That's that's a strong clickbait game right there. Boy. Yeah. Oh, my mom texted me. My yeah. grandma got in an accident. Nothing about the show, though. No, I'm kidding. I was like, bro, you really gonna <laughs> kill the mood like that? <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Fucking buzzkill, dude. <laughs> Holy shit. I live your guest. <gasps> I was like, are, are we good? I'm so sorry. <laughs> Jesus, man. That's what I do, baby. What if your grandma really gets in a car accident now? She has dementia. She ain't driving nowhere. Maybe that's what caused it. I saw my maternal grandmother sitting by the bank <laughs> of Go a ahead. swimming pool. Let it run, Dad. Which was also a river. Her genital region was exposed dimly. It had the appearance of a thick mat of hair. She was stroking herself absentmindedly. She walked over to me with a handful of pubic hair compacted into something resembling a large artist's paintbrush. She pushed this at my face. I raised my arm several times to deflect her hand. Finally, unwilling to hurt her or interfere with her any further, I let her have her way. She stroked my face with the brush gently and said, like a child. Yeah. Yeah. He That's goes it. so hard at the end there. <laughs> I could know? listen to that whole thing, bro. We got to get a longer version. Well, the, the uh, next part of that uh, has um, copyrighted music over it. It was oh, playing wait, what? Careless Whisper over it. At least where I pulled that from. Wait, no. <laughs> yeah. That's <laughs> not, that's not in the original. Not in the, the original. Not in the original, but the clip where, where I found that. Well, let's buy the audio. Oh, uh, that's, that's funny as shit. Dead. I bought it. I bought it. We have it. Yeah. We, we, yeah. I need that whole thing, Zach. Okay. I want to really. I just. I gotta wait till the moment's right and listen to the whole fucking show. <laughs> Careless whisper. <laughs> Maybe when Howie's here. Just play that during the. The episode. guests just are so flabbergasted by that. And they go, "What is that?" I go, "Oh." uh Great thinker of our time, Jordan Peterson, Dr. That's Jordan Peterson. The national anthem of the H3 podcast. Mm -hmm. I let rise. her have her way. <laughs> I let her have her way. Twitter's a fucking rat hole. All the right. One time he was right. Guys, see you tomorrow for members. See you on Wednesday for everybody. Love y'all. Be good. See you next time. This is Ethan. Say bye bye.